Good morning, everybody. Welcome, welcome, welcome to Mine O'Clock here on Loading Ready Run. Hope everybody's doing well this morning. Ah, shoot. Uh, I forgot to run a commercial at the beginning of this stupid... <sighs> okay, that's fine. We're just going to need to take... Uh, commercial breaks on the hours today, but that's okay. That's okay. Uh, Mewi, 35 months. Welcome back. Croca King for 67 months. Hello. And Galarati, uh, for six months. Let's mine those clocks. Seems like a good idea. Uh, it's er It's not early. It's 10 AM. <laughs> I've been up for like two hours, two and a half hours. <laughs> and pot 20 months, 20 months full of laughs and enjoyment. Uh, all right. We're here. We're ready to play some Minecraft. Aboard Barista for 24 months, two years. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Uh, friends? Hello? Hello. 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 Oh, no, we're How are you? Hi. Everything is perfect. Everything is great. Good morning, my friends. Everything is awesome. Everything is right. Uh, Wolf Strike, four months. Welcome back. Um, if you just gift every viewer who isn't subbed a sub, you won't have missed ad revenue. Uh, well, it's less the ad revenue and more that we have to run ads. <laughs> uh, all right. So, Minecraft. <laughs> what we're here for, the name of the day. That's what we play on this show. Well, is it though? Do we need to play it? Surge is quiet. He sounds fine to me. Surge talk. I am now louder. Hold on, let me go even louder. Yeah. I am now yeah, you sound, using my full strength. You I'm sound now totally fine to me. My final form. Uh, nine thousand. Over nine thousand. Oh wait, yeah, no. What if I stop just at nine thousand? Better. Cool. Uh, all right. So last week Uno wasn't here. Mm. Uh, and oh, and, and Serge and I made a well, to be honest, pretty terrible. What? Uh, How dare you? Pretty terrible farm. Um, You're a terrible farm. I love that farm. You it, take that back. Look, that farm has feelings <laughs> and hopes and dreams. Look, I want it to be good. I helped build it. I, I'm not saying that it's not pretty looking. I'm saying its function is not great. Unfortunately, there is just a big old hole in the in the nether hub here. Okay. Yeah, I remember when you were fighting a gas and... Uh, and then it shot that and we never fixed it. We like looked over and acknowledged that there was a hole in the side, but we're like, huh, wonder who's gonna <laughs> deal with that. The uh, answer was right. no one. Quillpaw, 21 months, welcome back. Uh, okay, so let's go this way. And let's go look at this farm. Because again, it's not, it's, it's not great. Whoa, what? T oh yeah, TQ joined the server. I was like, this is a new path. <laughs> I'll have to go check that out. Uh, all right, so if we go through here. And we come around the corner. We are greeted by, arguably, a very good-looking farm. Mm. It looks good. Mm. Uh, functionally, it's not good. Um, now, let's let's define not good. What are... What are what are some actual what, what, what are our KPIs? So the, yeah. the biggest issue is um, there was uh, almost, I would say, only about 20% of the netherwort made it to the bottom. Hold on a second here. Uh, that's bad. Yeah. Yeah. It It's not 20%. good. 20%. So yeah. of, of every okay. five, one would make it. Yeah. Where were they so, ending up, if not at the bottom? So the problem, the biggest problem was the glass panes. So I, I actually replaced all the glass panes. The problem with the glass panes is the water would just push them over the gap and they would get caught up along this half spot. Oh, so it, it wouldn't, it would get on the stone rather than dropping. So it wouldn't mind the gap if we wanted to use an English sure. saying there. Sure. Good so, joke. so you. yeah, good joke. So that was issue number one. Um, okay. So oh, there's I, multiple. Oh god. So I replaced all of the glass panes with glass blocks, and I believe that now, did help. 
Um, when we first laid out, though, the glass panes were there so you could actually reach everything. Yeah. So have so, you created another problem with the solution? Sure have. Because now, oh. uh, before, you could actually reach the back one. Now you can't. And you can actually only reach the front one by jumping. The only only space <laughs> that you can reach <laughs> is, the middle. is the middle. You can... Yeah. Again, we designed so it was working as intended. The issue is uh, our fix had some unintended consequences. Very interesting. And even planting here is is hard. Eh, eh. Come on, come on. There we go. So not great. Um, the yeah. other problem is uh, wait. There's more. Yeah. Oh, so <laughs> um, the little um, gaps that we've created up the side um also uh get chunked up or blocked up so we basically uh. need to go like this all the way up the side and close that oh, you, close that block in wait, wait why would you use cobble i did because it's the stone block i had on me um oh, like i'll, okay. I'll break well, it what happens with those blocks do they, they, they get, get nether wall on them yeah nether work gets hung up on those blocks um and then finally, um, at the very top, at the very tippy top, uh, yeah. there was there would always be an amount of uh, nether wart that just got left up behind. Yeah, I think that's. I mean, this farm is not going to be lossless. Yeah, so that's probably the least problematic issue. So the biggest right. one is the fix that I very quickly in like introduced which were the glass paint or the glass blocks helped for sure but have made planting now basically impossible <laughs> uh, why don't you use a so two blocks that come to mind do we want to try and fix this is the first thing we do today i, I think so i like i feel so, like we should try to fix this thing uh if i may make a suggestion if you need a full block right on the edge there for the water we could probably try replacing that with either a stair or a trap door I think both of those should work. Yeah. Uh, so let's let's give that a try. One second here. Trap uh, trapdoors, I think, might be better. Uh, am I stuck in here? All right, and then you're going to go up yeah. the side with a I don't know scaffold and, and then fill in that crack with smooth stone. Is that what I'm hearing? Yeah, though, hey, Uno, do you have any rockets? Can I have a rocket or two? Yeah, there you go. Thank you. I can get out. All right, so this is how that would look. Um, Actually, if we made that change. Do we like the stone there? Yeah, you walk on the stone. Yeah, look at this. If you come down to the bottom level. Uh, uh, what if you have sorry. phantoms? Question mark? Uh, sorry, one yeah. second. I think it's me. You sure it wasn't just one of us, like, just flying around? It's possible. It's also There's daytime. No there are no phantoms. I, you know what? I. It's I'll early. Take word for it. It's early. It is early, and thus <laughs> all of our faults are excused, right? Uh. Oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> what was that timing? I went to break a torch I just put down, and oh my god, I'm just gonna go do something wow. else here. Surge, just <laughs> smashing the state, as it were. All right, so, ah, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think that's going to be a pretty clean solution. And you can get right up and you can plant everything easy peasy. Uh, let me just check. Yeah. yeah so I'm going to do back. a I'm going to do a tremendous amount of work here. And then um, we should do a test flush just to see if that does what we want it to do. So, yeah, we want it's like in real life. I always test flush. Ah. <laughs> uh, Here's an interesting question, James. Yeah. Um, what if we treat this? Oh, sorry. What if we treat this farm kind of like a uh, a faulty toilet? Maybe it just needs two flushes. <laughs> <laughs> you know? Like, what if you you flush once and you're like, ah, something remains. Let's just hit that old flush button a second time. And up. How are you doing for sugarcane, by the way? Uh, we should probably try and get you a shulker box just full of 
food and or rockets. It's it's vanilla, you know, we can we can get you these things. I just need to do it off stream sometime. I'm just bad at it. Uh, yeah. All right. And like, does your have you repaired your silk touch pickaxe? Not yet. Do you want to just give that to me? And once I'm done this, I'll just go do that right now. No, that's fine. Or you could show off the new functioning farms. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah. Like, I'm definitely... We, I want to go check out all the new farms anyway, so... I want to get this fixed, and then I want to go check out what's been going on, and then I think we can start figuring some stuff out with the... Oh, who's been planting? I've been going through planting. Yeah, well, neat. We're a team. Yeah. Also, also this elevator is now terrifying. What? Well, so if you're running back and forth by the um, by the trapdoors, you you sort of back on and it feels like you can miss it. Oh, we should have torches in here. I just realized this is potentially also a mob farm that we've made. Uh, the ghost like with the most, thirty six months, and uh, Branson five six seven for forty three months. Thank you, friends. Uh, okay. I'm going to start putting some torches on these floors so we don't die. Yep. I ran out of the wall. All right, so... Um, did you check the chest at the bottom? Yep. I just didn't bring enough with me. Oh. <laughs> like, I planted two stacks, I think? Okay. So the nice thing is, is that it still looks pretty good. I think it looks... A teeny bit worse. Mm. Um, just because we lost all that glass, which I think does does make it look kind of good. Can't play games, 35 months. Thank you, friend. Um, but overall, I think the aesthetic is still close enough uh, that we uh, that I think we can feel pretty good here. We haven't named it. The Wart Apartments. Wart, 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 Wart Towers. Wart Towers is pretty good, yeah. Warts and all sounds like a department store as opposed to some place where you live, though. All right, so let's take all of this nether wart out. Okay. Watering Heights. So, um, I mean, we can, let's just test it. Like, I know it's not ideal because nothing's really grown a lot yet, but, uh, wait. Oh, no, we're good. Um, but at least we can see if, like, anything is getting, like, massively caught up. Stuck, so, yeah. So I'm just going to go into spectator mode and, uh, Surge, if you want to hit the button. Uno, please. Or Uno, hit the button. The button's down there. Okay, there we go. Uh, so a little bit getting stuck there. Nice. Wait, now do the double flush, you know? Do the double flush. Well, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, right, right, right. Um, this is all looking much, much better. Is it just sending a, a pulse of water down? It's sending, yeah, because it, it's a double, it's a double uh, pulse, so it turns itself on and off. So we should, okay, so uh, careful not to grab any. Oh, um, yeah. Yeah. We should be getting it's 27 per uh per row, right? Yeah. So, how many rows do we have? 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 four, eight, yeah. 9. So, what's 9 times 27? Yeah. Anybody with anybody with math? 243. 243. Thank what's, you, two, what's 243 divided by 64? And you want a remainder, right? Well, I mean, the question is, have we got any um, left now, over? The, the hoppers are still doing stuff right yeah, now. Yeah, just, just okay. So I, I can see a piece here and in there and yeah, yeah, yeah but we'll wait we'll wait we'll see what the double flush does right so we'll get the first one we'll wait for the hoppers to stop doing stuff and then we'll do the second flush and we'll see how much waste is after that because if we just decide there's a two flush technique then we're uh, we're laughing right i mean i can tell you right now 
All right. Uh, so we have three okay. full stacks and 24 in the chest right now. Okay. And we should have... 3.8. Okay. Um, so flush it again. 3 and 24, 3.8. Uh, 24 is like 3.4, I guess. So that... we lost 0.4 of a stack. So that... Okay, so there's a few pieces up top. What the heck's with the sirens, yo? What's going on? Sorry. It's not, it's not your fault. Unless you started the fire that they're running towards. Shh, 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 don't tell anyone. Okay. So I can't see it. I can't see any more coming down. It, it's coming. There is some. Ah. Yeah, the water stream isn't done flushing yet. Oh, there's there a go. there's a bit coming. There's a couple. Yeah, there there's still more. Yeah, wait for the water pulse to finish before we make any acknowledgments of what happened there. So we had three stacks in twenty four. So let's check what the second flush gets us. Okay, the flush is done. Oh, got us another twenty. So we have three stacks and forty four. And Belek did the math. We're supposed to have three stacks and 51. We only lost seven nether wart. Well, so we lost... Okay, so hold on a second, because I'm going to go into uh, survival. Um, and I have... Okay, I'm going to throw this away, because all the other ones are full. Okay, so we'll grab here, 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 here. Okay, from the top, I've just picked up seven. Yeah, th and, that should be it. Uh, and then I've gotten... Two more from there. Because remember, some Wait. of it did grow. Oh, yeah. interesting. Okay. It's not, it's not going to be exact. Sure, I understand. Uh, shoot. Okay, so we're good there. I don't see any out here. Um, nothing out here. Uh, it's a little bit right there. Nothing there, and nothing there, and nothing there. Okay, so I got, by running down there, I got 10 more. Oh, yeah, that's not bad. I think, honestly, the trap doors did a pretty good fix. Second flush was interesting. Second flush didn't get a I, huge amount, the, but like... The majority of it, yeah. I think, came from the top. Yeah, I mm. think... I think it's okay if a farm has a little bit of loss. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Honestly. No, no, absolutely. Like the amount of, yeah, that, the amount of work you have to go in to make a completely lossless farm no, I, versus <laughs> what you can just do with your life if you, you know, you don't do that. Yeah, like the plan was to never make this loss, lossless, but it yeah, was yeah. it was in rough shape uh, from last week. Uh, well, so, luckily with our massively developed brains. Yeah, so this yeah, should work a little bit better. So let me just replant real quick here. I'm going to start from the top and make my way down. Man, uh, after last week, I think it was last week, I complained about the um, field of view change when you are uh, moving fast. Yeah. Uh, and they actually are uh, putting an option in the game to remove that. Isn't that cool? Like, they actually announced really it like that accessibility That'll option. Be. And they're getting rid of the, the stupid, like, nausea effect. Or not getting rid of it, but again, you can turn it down or off. For going through like nether like portals, post -pro all the post-processing stuff. All right, cool. Son of a! It's also uh, a lot easier to get out if you get trapped. Uh, ah, yes, yeah. yeah inside yeah, yeah. the farm now. It's, it's maintenance access. Yeah, now you can actually get out if you fall, if you find yourself inside the farm. Here we go. Okay. Perfect. And I'm going to put all the nether wart that I have in here. This will never work. <laughs> There's a lot. And is this just a box of random stuff? Uh, yeah, that was the mess that we made okay, while I'll, we're building. I'll clean all this Basically, up every time you make a farm of any size, you accumulate at least one shame chest. Yeah, I'll clean all that up later. Ah, the Minecrafter's fallacy. <laughs> 
It's not it's not a shame chest if you're not ashamed of it. Ooh. Yeah, there you go. Who know the wise? All right. Uh, my friends, now that we have all this nether wart, should we go through the uh, the joy of trying to rip up the slabbing in the nether hub? What do you want to work on today? Well, okay. So I'm going to um, where? Okay, I'm gonna go to what farms have we built? What what have Since I missed? Since you've been on last, um, we have a fully functioning gold farm. We have a fully functioning guardian farm, and we have a fully functioning lighthouse. Uh, okay. Which one can get me XP? I mean, obviously the uh, ender end can get me XP, but only uh... only the gold farm can get you experience. Wait, the elder elder farm, the guardian farm can't. No, the guardian farm is passive only, because uh, uh. Joe's like, I could make a bunch of work for this, or, seeing as how we already have two excellent experience farms, why would I make another one? All right, so the gold can get me XP, so let's go there. All right. Oops. All right. I really need to get soul movement thing on my uh, boots again. Well, if we get working on the trading hub soon, then we should all be able to get soul speed three for those maximum zoomies. All right. Welcome to the gold farm. Wait, there's a portal up here now. Oh, yeah. I thought running through on the ground was, like, dumb. So I decided to go a different way. But that's what the nether port, the hub is for. Come on, Serge. Yeah, but the hub doesn't exist yet, and you're not working very fast. I mean, you can, <laughs> you can, you can do it. No, I found a faster way. I found a workaround. Boo. What? Ow. All right, so... Anyways, welcome to Hal Dorado. I mean, so we saw this last week. It just wasn't done yet. Ender chest over there. Cool. Oh, that's the AFK room. Okay. And then if I come in here and hit this button. Yeah, you got it. And then they'll start dropping. Yeah, so what the button does is it extends honey blocks. Uh, mobs that fall on honey blocks won't take damage. One second. Uh, or they won't oh take God, fall the damage. Noise. Yeah, it turns down the hostile creatures. This is now, slow. No, it hasn't been mob proofed yet. So the way, obviously, the mob cap works is it loads within... I think it's 128 blocks of any player right now. So if you hit F3, you'll find that we're at about 220. Now, there's different ways to build this farm. And unfortunately, when we decided on the location of the nether hub for like the gold trading area, um, we didn't pick it directly above a lava ocean. So there are more valid spawning points beneath us right now. So mm. one big thing that I'm going to have to do or that we could do or that a number of us could do is actually go down and slab button or otherwise um, despawn or spawn proof a very large area. Uh, something yeah. we could do to make this significantly more efficient is if uh, we all kind of flew up to the AFK platform for a second, we could unload everything beneath us. And that would make this better. So now that we're up at 256, when we start thinking about the blocks beneath us, uh, that puts us in the 120 layer. And there's actually not a lot of spawnable spaces in the nether up at this height. So I don't actually have to do much, yeah, if can... any, spawn proofing to make the farm work really well as an AFK farm. But as we go lower, and if you visualize the nether beneath us, every block we go down increases more and more blocks yeah. that uh, we'll eventually have to spawn proof. So I mean, yeah, you if you start watching the being, level. Yeah. yeah, you can see it being more efficient right now. And they're probably just yeah. dying to the mob, to cramming in there now. Yeah, so if you jump down now, you should be in a much better situation to repair very quickly. Ow. I like how you managed to fly directly into the cactus. <laughs> there you go. Yeah. Now is that is that the sort of yeah. drops you're or the sort of experience rate you're hoping for? 
Much better. Uh, we'll yeah, it's nice that they're forming an elderly queue up here. Alright. Uh, switch that back. And now they will... Crawl and die. Uh, cool. If, if I may take a second here, I don't know if you've had a chance to look at sort of the guts of this farm. I'm unbelievably proud of this thing. Unbelievably proud of this thing. All right. Uh, so if you'd like to join me down one layer. Now, please, 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 a million times, please, never touch these hopper mine carts. Well, hopper never, mine carts. never, 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 ever touch these hopper mine carts. This is the only way any of you could ever break the farm is if you move these hopper mine carts out of the way. I don't even know um, which hopper mine carts you're talking about. So. Yeah. Do you, do you, uh, go into creative mode and fly up to where I am, James. Well, no, if I don't know where they are, I can't ever break them. I, mm, okay, they're above the spider webs. <laughs> Why would I ever go above the spider webs? Perfect. Um, this farm produces more items per hour than a hopper can handle, or that basically any number of hoppers can handle. And another thing that's very interesting in the nether is you can't use water streams to move items. So what you have is this really cool system of pistons uh, that actually push and funnel all of the items together. And like, I just think that's so cool, right? Oh, by the way, uh, if you see a bunch of items sitting on here and you're like, hey, Serge, your farm is broken. The farm only works when you have a critical density of items that are already moving, which is also very interesting. Uh, sorry, so let's like, look at the subs in a minute. So when is that going to start pushing things? Uh, well, again, since you're lower down, you're holding more of the mob caps. It's not working as efficiently as it otherwise could. Oh, so it's our fault. <laughs> yes. Well, but, yeah. It, but I want to watch this thing my work. Fault that I yet. There's so many items here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But that's, that's only a small fraction of all of the items that are there. So you'll see once... Yeah, you need a lot, a lot, a lot of items to make this work. If you and Una were both in spectator mode, it would work a little bit better because again, you're lower and you're you're holding a lot of the mob cap. All right, I'm in spectator mode. And if Uno flew up to like the top of the layer there, hang on. Yeah, because the the lower Uno is the more of the mob cap that's being held there. All there right, so now you should see the pistons start firing, right? So this is a big project that I'll probably want to do off stream sometime. But isn't that fascinating? So the cobwebs exist. Um, Hoppers have a chance to sort of like spew items all over the place. Like they have uh, they have a bit of a spray radius. So the cobwebs catch all the items and make sure they fall perfectly straight down so they land in the correct spot in the middle of the block. So that when the pistons push everything, it goes into basically it's a very calculated path. It's fascinating. This is the coolest thing I have ever made in Minecraft. Who designed this? Uh, this is a Nembomb design. Nice. Yeah, and it was actually very interesting because Nembomb doesn't do tutorials in the way of, okay, here's the blocks you place, this is how you figure it out. It's just, it's more like a video essay on, here are the mechanics on how mob spawning works. Here's the mechanics on, like, item movement. It's it back and forth, over and over. And I had to, like, pause the video, take screenshots, download the world, and, like, dissect and rebuild it. It was really, really, really interesting. Where... What is your sorting system here like? Uh, there is gold, then there are gold ingots, and that's it. Everything else goes into lava. Oh, that's where the minecarts are, right? Yes, 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 yes. Yeah, for the love of God and all that is holy, <laughs> never touch the minecarts. Hmm. <laughs> My chat's like, I've never wanted to touch anything more. <laughs> <laughs> bad, bad. No, um, the minecarts... You have to place them on a rail, push them into position, break the minecart, and then nudge them into a corner. It also involved a bunch of weird shenanigans of, like, using a piston to sneak other blocks under them. Um, and if you nudge them, they'll move out of position. And they are fanned out in such a way to pull... Because hopper minecarts will pull out items faster than a normal hopper. So yeah. all the hoppers above collect the items. Then this weird... It's a fan. It's not a funnel because it, it fans it out, pulls all the items out... And it distributes it to all of these droppers. Yeah, and... 
it, it, because they're in the corner, is one hopper minecart able to actually pull from four hoppers? Uh, if is you that, hit F3, is that the theory? If you hit F3 plus B, you can actually see the hitbox of a hopper or of a hopper minecart yeah. in relation to the hoppers it's over. Uh, all right. Sorry. Yeah, I just need to read a bunch of these here. Uh, Sepsis, 30 months. Welcome back. Two flush dump. Uh, brand new sub. Welcome to the channel. Thanks to the Mary Cat. El Coggins, 14 months. Hysteria for three. Wow for 10. Banther for 37. Nomi for 55. Woodenhead for 40. Cyber Cypher for 10. TK, that's me for 43. And Code Gorilla for 53. Thank you, friends. Appreciate it. Uh, all right. Is it worth, like, encasing them or something in, in well, glass no, so you can't nope. even... If you don't touch them, if you know never to go there, then no one can touch it. There's only four people on the server. Uh, There's not like a user base that you have to worry that's going to screw it up. There's five. There's five people on the server. Pardon me. Uh, all right. Uh, There's six people on the server. Oh, yeah, there's six. There's seven people on the server. There's now the four people on the server. The gold farm is now broken. Oh, my God. There's the 88 farm? people on the server. What's going on? <laughs> All right, so uh, it's growing. It's yeah. Okay. So this room, um, we dug out, lit up, uh, slabbed, <clears throat> and then we haven't touched it for three weeks. Yeah. Um, what the heck are we doing with this room? Well, the original goal was going to be to make a, a piglin trading hall. Yeah. I mean, Piglin Trading Hall slash, like, kind of like Nether Hub, right? Like, this is, like, we've got, you know, we've got the 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 ways in and out. Um, it's at the same level as as uh, all of our Nether portals. It's uh, it's the access to the gold farm. Um, I do wonder how how hard would it be to get to to funnel all the gold from the gold farm into this room. Silence. <laughs> yeah, wow, just nothing from Surge. So again, it's a, it's a weird issue of how many items a hopper can move. I, honestly, Considering the amount of hours that we have in a week for this particular show, I don't think it's it's worth it. Well, I was talking about you. You would do that. Yeah, nah, dog. <laughs> <laughs> it's not me. I just you know it would be cool if all the gold just funneled directly into so where the we issue want to is, trade it. There'd be an easier way to do it pre-sorting it. But the fact that we're already sorting out all the items and the lava means it's ending up in hoppers and in a chest. So you'd have to get it out of that again. You know what I mean? Like just having hoppers straight down from the sorting system to here is not a not a good call. Why not? Yeah. I mean, so the other thing something something we could do uh, theoretically is we could have a crafting station up top because you we probably don't want the nuggies down here, but you could make it so there's a chute that as soon as you're done turning all the nuggies into bars, that funnels down. Yeah, that'd be cool. Uh, it was oh, just an idea. Barn. Anyways. Look, uh, that, little, that little pig has a, a nether rack. <laughs> no! Pat, Pat you monster! Rack. That was rocky! Oh. Uh, I, mean, I was half, half contemplating, like dropping but the annoying thing is droppers don't drop straight down they offset a little bit uh there are four lights brand new sub welcome thanks to the merry cat all right so which is always awkward what what do we have any ideas what this room is going to look like well there's an important discussion we have to have of is this a large open room in which we decorate the walls and thus um, you walk into it from the exterior and you, you know what I mean? Like, is this an interior or is this a cave that's going to house a house? What the hell was that? Mm. What? Sorry, what? What was your question? What just flew across the screen? Uno? Did anybody else Me? see that? 
please tell me somebody else saw the thing fly across the stream. Anybody? No. Not, not. Chat? Can can you please clip that and send it to me? Nope. It was not. Uh, it was not an arrow. Mm -hmm. I'm. It kind of reminded me of that weird like uh, uh, fish head that was flying oh. around the Hermitcraft server. Mm. Uh, the cardiac people. Eighteen months. Nothing is there. I mean, I'm sort of running around and jumping and. Flying. No, it was it was up up near the top of the the ceiling. Pretty sure it was something. Anyways, whatever. Uh, could okay. Could have been a soul particle effect. It uh, could have been. Beams. I mean, it could have been. I, yeah, I don't know. Uh, a Wells, fifty-two months. I saw it. Thank you. Okay. Um. Yeah, I mean, it was these things. So. I like the idea of, hey, I like the idea of, like, a room with spaces in it, right? Like, I don't know. Um, like, we've done two fairly big open space builds uh, in the last year, right? We had the big, yeah. the big loo. Or the Gigaloo. And we had our last Nether Hub, which was basically this, but smaller. Um, but still a very big open room with tunnels off in the four directions. Um my my issue with just building like a house in here is that its surroundings do not look very natural in a big box. Well, we I mean you fixed that afterwards, right? Yeah. Like what we've created is a canvas. And either way, either way, we're going to have to change the surroundings, right? We're either going to change the surroundings by decorating them, and thus this entire space becomes a room, or we make a bunch of little buildings inside of this, and then we make it either look like a cave, or we decorate it with something else on the exterior too, right? Like that's welcome to the nature of having a blank canvas. It's always hard to imagine what's in here. It's worth mentioning the Piglin bartering the hull, especially if you want to automate it, will be quite small. Yeah. A couple people have clipped your weird ghost, James. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. There was definitely something weird that just flew across the screen there. What the what? What? I have to have a look at this. Yeah. I think it was just a particle. Like, it looks like just a particle effect. Is oh, there... yeah. Yeah, I think it's just a particle effect, but I think it's just like... It got big in that one... Sp it got big there. It's it's weird. If you just pause it and, and look, it's like literally two pixels, but they're big. Yeah, it's like two, two squares. Yeah. Okay. Here's what I'm thinking. Okay. We we create we dome this thing out, this room out. Dome. Yeah. Ah, so like a hell glue. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> basically. But in the center like so this is still basically the center is like right about where I'm standing, right? Give or take. So you you start. So this is an even room because it's based on chunks, I believe. Right. Um. Uh, yes, it's. Yeah, it's not uh, three by three chunks. So. Yeah. So the center is going to be a, a two by two. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So in the center, what if we built a cool big nether house? Um, but gave it a little bit more room to breathe by pushing back the walls. Maybe not like, a, it, I, I'm not suggesting like a perfect dome. Um, maybe we could even do it with like with TNT. So it is mm. worth remembering that a lot of these walls are artificial. It's actually going to be a lot of work 
to try and expand this shape as uh, a big portion of this is just floating out over Lava Lake. That's fair. Yeah. So, like, some uh, an easy amount of work would be to actually shrink this room by making a... I mean, we'd lose the ceiling effect, but, like, that might just happen anyways, right? Yeah. I mean, rather than just come up with a random shape, I think it'd be more interesting to define what the build is. Because if we have a round room, we end up with the same problem of, mm -hmm. okay, now what? Right? Like, mm -hmm. you're like, we have the same problem we originally had, except now instead of a cube, we have a dome. <laughs> I mean, what, what do we want to put in here and where do we want to put it, uh, I think is another thing. Yeah, what if we what if we do the opposite of what we normally do on Mine O'Clock? Uh, James, uh, you normally like to start with, let's build a shape and then figure out what to do with it after. And this is where we are. We have made a shape. We don't know what to do with it. What if we start putting the infrastructure we actually care about in it first? Like, what if we just made the trading hall? And then once that's done, once we start to figure out where everything's going to go, if we want a better access up to the roof, if we want gold to be funneled in, if we want a trading area, build that. And then, oh, okay, now we have some context to what's going to go into this room. Let's build something around it after. Now you're thinking with Unos. It's James's turn to be very silent. <laughs> I'm just, I'm just thinking. While we're just thinking, should we be ripping up the floor and putting down the red brick? It I mean, does kind of bother me. We still need so much more red brick. Well, let, like, let's, I mean, let's, let's get where the head, Like, we're not even loading the nether wart farm as we stand in here. Oh, no, no, don't rip it up first. Don't rip it up first. This room is spawn proof. If you rip it up before we have a replacement, we'll get gas and it'll blow up. That is why I slabbed it before we did anything. Because leaving it blank is the wrong way to go. Wait, aren't these? Oh, no, they're not. Never mind. Yeah. Apologies to uh, to cut you off there. Yeah. So, like, if we're having this discussion, we could be smelting blocks. Uh, we could be literally loading the netherwork form, farm so we could be getting more of these blocks. But, like, yeah, just standing here visualizing, it's kind of tricksy. You got you to gotta, so, you gotta think sometimes, though. Um, You're going towards my base. We could be putting up thing. better documentation for the tunnels. Get our what? No, I wasn't and... going towards your base. Your base is right there. Yeah, you. Sorry. I was just taking the long way around. Oh, okay. Okay. Um. Uh. Now where? Yeah, there's no signs at that junction, which is a little weird. Here, let me. I'm gonna I'm gonna add some signs. Uh Jodorowsky, 40 months. You saw nothing. Gifted a sub by the Mary Cat. Dappy Gosling, two months. Antichrist for 27 months, and the exploded game for 26 months. No, I missed last month. Do we have Sorry. a ton of Netherrack? Uh I mean yeah. Netherrack is like the easiest block in the game to get a lot of. Yeah. Yeah. And probably no. All the Netherrack that we gathered, we threw directly into lava. <laughs> okay. So, um, I should have brought some coal as well. What was I going to say? I had, I had an opinion and a thought and it was formed and now I've lost it. Um, like if we're looking for something to do, we could start the great slabbing of the nether. So, I mean, okay, so I guess here's the thing. Um, you, I mean, you rightfully so pointed out that we are we have limited time with this show, right? Yeah. So, um, while slapping the nether will make that gold farm better, it's boring as hell. And, oh, yeah, no, no, um, fair enough. Um, yeah, yeah, that's probably not the best thing to do for Mod O'Clock. And I guess, I guess um, the reason why I'm more keen to build something in that space rather than just build, say, the Piglin Trading Farm is because... I was I I am excited to play with especially like because I want to like build with the new blocks, sure. Like I want to play with blackstone and I want to play with this nether brick and stuff like that, and uh, 
I feel like we have a tendency to build farms and then just walk away. Oh, okay. Sure, sure, sure. Mm -hmm. uh, rather than making them look kind of cool, which is kind of what I would prefer to do on this show. Um, just make things look cool. Yeah, which is make things Heck look yeah. look cool and build rather than build efficient farms. Sure. Uh, mainly because, like, people have, like, especially even just within this little ecosystem, already have a lot of that with your stream and Joe, Joe's stream, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, like, this was fun, because this was, like, a very easy farm to build. Um, but also, also we had a chance to, yeah. we, we also had the chance to actually make it look, you know, not but. Mm. Because it was, you know, fairly small and compact and stuff, so. Um, uh, far too much sarcasm for 53 months. Welcome back. I'll go and grab... I should have a load another rack as well to smelt up, so I'll go and grab. I mean, we have about 13 stacks of nether wart, so we can definitely make new... Because you have to smelt the nether rack first, right? Because you yeah, need nether. It's nether brick plus the. Um... The one of the one of the other advantages of um, guess, actually, let's go doing the piglin head. trading hall is you can get nether brick from the piglins. Yes. I have I have two stacks of nether brick that I'll bring back as well. Which I have okay, I have sixty nether brick and that's it. Because I used everything I had to make what I did. Oops. A house made of ancient debris seems reasonable. Seems blast proof. J Rod, thanks for the sixty nine bits, friend. Appreciate it. Okay, so we can make 30. We made 30. Ugh. And then we can make... Does the stone cutter give us better returns here? Because this is going to give us 60. No. Yeah, this is going to give us 60 slabs, right? Yeah, so this is it's, the stone cutter is no different, right? Like, th does the stone cutter ever give better returns? Is that how that works? Is it supposed to work like I that? I think it does for stairs and stuff. How much? How much nether wart have we got here? A couple of stacks, okay. Like, yeah, the stone cutter gives better returns on stairs. Same return on slabs. Okay. The real advantage of the stone cutter is like smooth stone can be turned into um, brick stairs in one step, you know, it like lets you skip a couple of steps. Uh, there's nearly a stack of nether brick, red nether brick. Oh, there you just gave me. And bam. Okay. I've got 64 plus times 2 plus 46. Um, so we need a lot more, uh, netherrack. What's smelting here? I have... Ah, more netherrack. I have a ton of netherrack. Um... Well, do we have a super smelter? No, but I'm just gonna make a lot of furnaces. I've got a 16 furnace array smelter at my base. Or 8 or something like that. It's actually pretty fast to make one of two if you wanted to do that. It's always kind of a fun build. I've just made 24 furnaces. I was just going to plonk some furnaces down somewhere and just start smelting netherrack. You want to go to a basalt area and just start like knocking all that down for blocks too? Start collecting all the blocks for it. Like, what kind of block palette you were, were you imagining for uh, all the new stuff? I mean, bas using basalt and blackstone and the red. I mean, the nether. The th this isn't a new stone. The red nether brick has is been in the game for a while, but I just thought it would look cool with the black. So, 
Uh, yeah, we could go. We could. I mean, that could actually be fun. We could go just tear down a bastion. I thought. I thought that might be kind of interesting. Get a bunch of blocks there. We'll get that gilded blackstone as well. Yeah. I think there's actually one pretty close to our nether hub as well that I kind of accidentally stumbled upon the other day. So that could be a fun thing we could we could do today. It's just tear down a, a bastion for the blackstone. All right, there are now some signs. All right, I got five more stacks of nether slabs, so I'm gonna come back and do down this. Also, where's my? I don't know where my ender chest is. Sorry. All right, I'm starting to cook up a lot of netherrack. <laughs> I need more coal. Get out, get out, get out, get out. Why do I have a random diamond? I don't know why that's in there. Is that another in the rocket box? Uh... The rocket box got kind of messy. Oh yeah, there is too. Sick. Yeah, this box got messy. Clean this up later. By clean it up later, I mean not clean it up later. <laughs> Never do it. All right. Some more nether wart. I've made a wall of cooking. It is the wall of cooking. Okay, I now have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven and a <laughs> half stacks of the slabs. So I'm gonna go slab it up. Okay. It, yeah. It's probably it's probably kind of telling that I made 24 rather than 25 of these. Uh, I should probably sleep actually. Oh. Uh, you're worried about phantoms? Yeah, go ahead. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I slept for a bit. Chunks of 16 by 16, yeah. Yeah. Okay, so. Hub. Like my new signs? Yeah, the signs are good. I don't want to say it's guaranteed that you won't get lost, but certainly will help. I, I don't see any signs. Are, are you in the nether hub, Uno? No. Well, then there's your problem. Ah. Well, I was I was looking at you and you were talking about signs, and but you stood there. <laughs> I was very confused. It's like, this, it doesn't have any signs there. Ugh. 
Oh, it's a good sound. This place in that block just have like a good. It has a good bricky sound to it. I believe they have a, a good the, ear feel. Yeah. They updated a bunch of the, a bunch of the sounds of like nether blocks. So like breaking nether rack, for example, has this like very weird moist feel to it now. Yeah. <laughs> Son of, I hate this mouse. Yeah. You ever just sit and watch nether wart grow? It's very peaceful. Like paint drying. No. No, paint's thrilling in comparison. <laughs> you should try managing these furnaces. So this is four chunks. So uh, three by three. So nine uh, chunks. Oh, it's three by three. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So each row is sixty-four. Each row should be one stack. That's what sixteen times three is, right? N no. What? Thirty plus what's? 30? Uh, forty-eight. It's 48. Yeah, it's 48. It's That's what a short. chunk is, right? Chunk is 48? <laughs> no, chunk is 16. No, 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 no. Right. No, no, dog. Um, so it's it's for every row and a quarter, we need a stack. Right? So let's let's do let's see if we're right here. If I do this, and then I place if I take a stack, this stack should last us. For this whole length. There's so much still in that one. Bam. We did the math. One's easy for Uh, Eternal Roxas, 53 months. Welcome back. Thank you, friends. Uh, friends, I need to take a quick commercial break because I completely forgot to do one at the start of the show. Um, I'm going to actually just keep placing blocks, um, which is not very exciting, so you're not going to miss much. But uh, hold tight, and I'll be back in just a few moments. I'm also going to mute uh, Discord and friends. So uh, you'll if you don't get ads, you're just going to hear me placing blocks. So give me a moment. Yo. All right, we're back. Welcome back, my friend. Uh, all right, I'm out of bricks. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. I have thirteen stacks of nether brick. Ooh. All right, bringy, bringy. So that will it's double. Not red. It's it's not red nether brick. It's just the bricks. Oh, oh, we still have to combine it with nether wart. All right, I'm still waiting for this. I, you know what? Let me do Let me do an early harvest here just so that uh, y'all are unblocked. There's a good amount of nether wart there still, I think. Like, there's still, like, five or six stacks. I yeah, think. Uno, here. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Take all of this. I'll restock with what we have there. You should be able to get a pretty good amount and then maybe go help James on that side, and I'll, I'll operate this side. Yeah. The facade is a lie, James. We could fall to our death at any point. I, I want I want a piece of oh, I'm gonna take one of these. There isn't enough room in this chest for all my nether. I, well, maybe there is. Uh, there's Can wood. We... Make another chest. That's how shame has to accumulate. It's it's exactly enough. Uh, so the nether brick is in this chest. Hey, there's some nether rack in here. Let's set that to cooking. You want to make it all into slabs and bring it to me, please? Uh, yeah, I will do. Uh, spawn proof my butt. Yeah. 
No, I was being there. There's totally mobs in here. No, his his butt is spawn proof. Uh -huh. Nothing nothing spawns on that. So something exciting that one point sixteen point two is changing is you're gonna be able to put slabs on top of the soul sand road and still get the zoomies. Oh really? Yeah. Huh. Which I'm pretty excited about that because I think specifically for this reason of currently you can't spawn proof it. God, the zoomies, the zoomies sounds like, you know, like a stomach ailment. It really does. <laughs> yeah, I know there's valid gas spawns, it's fine. Yeah, I've got a really bad case of the zoomies. You... You can button it? That's true, you could button it. Do you just want the slabs, or do you want me to stop placing them? I can take the slabs, if you want to keep making them. I need more, so... Uh... Sweet! Thank you. Uh, boom. Demir whispers for two months. Almost a year. Uh, sure. Uh, SFS mouse for 12. That's a year. Welcome back. Uh, so I think we're, we're pretty much out of netherrack. Mining session. Yeah, so I'm gonna grab. I'm gonna grab some more netherrack. It's hard to do to the music. <laughs> uh, I tried. Ah! Okay. Lava. Okay. Okay. You ever plant something and watch it immediately grow? You're just like, ooh. The what game the tech RNG is in my favor today. Alright, I got some more stacks here. Can't remember why the bone mill works on souls on the no, it does not. It does not. Otherwise, we'd make yeah. Oh, trust me, the farm would be very different if that worked. <laughs> ah! So many things. It's like now, does that actually work or is that modded? I can never remember. So how much do you have on you, James? Like, how much more do you think we need at this point? Uh, I have a... Oh, we've got nether... Yeah, we've got, like, uh, nine stacks of nether bricks. We're probably fine for netherrack. I think the bottleneck right now is actually just the, uh, the wart. And how are you doing? Sorry, I cut you off. Um, probably gonna need... I mean, one, two, three, four, five, six... So it was what, three? We need three stacks for every four rows, right? I would say I probably we... need another like 10 stacks of slabs. Okay. I mean, I can, yeah, do, that, the, I can that, do the exact math in a minute actually, so. Those, those nine stacks will not last as long as you hope. Well, they're almost done. It's right. Oh, wow. You need two. So, right, 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 right. Yeah. We don't need to double the amount of brick we so have I've there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 
12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. 18 times whatever this was again, 40 whatever. All right. So we said every three rows is four stacks. Or is it the other way around? Every four every four rows is three stacks. Uh, you need four and a half. Four and a half stack. No, 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 no. Every row is. Somebody saying thirteen point five. What? Thirteen point five stacks. Every row is forty eight. Is forty eight, and we have, and then we have seventeen rows left. Every yeah, stack yeah. is so one point four rows, three rows. Every, three stacks. Yeah, yeah. I, we're saying the same thing, just different ways. We just need a lot. No, no, no. We need thirteen and a half. I like that people are doing that. Thirteen and a half stacks. Okay. So Uno, how many bricks do you get out? Is it a one to one ratio when you smelt the Netherrack? Uh, yeah, it's one to one. All right. Um, we have nine stacks of brick right now. So. Yeah, as soon as you get, I don't know. You don't need like a full inventory. Uh, so let's see. I've probably got. Um. Nine plus another six stacks. That's probably enough. Uh, fifteen stacks. Of netherrack. So fifteen plus nine. That's going to be twenty-four. Uh, 24 is 12. No, it's not enough. You need another four stacks. Another four stacks. Okay. Okay. Uh, Sean Ranger, 12 months and the fourth decibel or decimal. Brand new sub. Welcome to the channel. Thank you, friend. Uh, okay. Dropped in a small hole and my heart sank. Oh man, if you fell into lava, you're like, all my work. Up in well, that corner. netherrack. I never thought I'd be so sad. <laughs> uh, I'm just going to risk it. It's a shame it. that we haven't done a big build that involved... Oh wow, we're almost out of coal in the mine o'clock base too for smelting. Uh, we've got some coal ore. No, there's like 20. I counted that. Yeah, that's oh. not... Yeah. <laughs> so, question for you, James. Mm -hmm. We've got the hole in the roof here, and it's in a weird position. You can't even directly access to it. What should we do about that? Mm -hmm. Should we try and make it wider? Should we try and do like a three by three or something? I mean, we'd want a two by two, right? Oh, right. Of course, because it's... Yeah, that's fair. How would you even do that? I guess you have to try and look up all sorts of weird different shapes of, of different glitches. Because the one I have right now is a three by two. So I don't know how I would make a two by two hole. I could make a three by three. I guess I guess make it bigger. Oh, that, that sounds miserable. <laughs> I think I'm pretty much full of netherrack. All right. So I think if I do this, I can make it so that gas yep. can't spawn in here. So I might as well just do this. Good enough. I'm full. I can't carry anymore. Ooh, 16 by 16. Yeah, punch that bedrock chunk. We just punch out the middle one. Easy peasy. This camera uh -huh. seems very bright right now. Right. Are you the first stream since the uh, since no. the PPR? Uh, no cam stream yesterday. Oh, okay. 
joking. Uh, all right. Oh, you're very smart. I like that. I like your strategy there, James. Yeah, well, I mean, Picklins can still spawn, but at least Gas can't. And at least I'm doing something. Yeah. Well, I'm waiting you got for gold more. Money, you're fine. Yeah. Okay. Joe, once we're done uh, slabbing this room, I think we're going to go tear down a bastion if you want to come. Actually, since Uno's here and loading the Netherwart farm, I'm going to go find that bastion. Unless you want to hunt for it together on camera. I might as well hunt for it together. <clears throat> All right. Rip it down for all of its resources. How many spare shulker boxes does everyone have? As this is the sort of thing that we should prepare for before we get there. I have four. Uh, I have a good amount. I, have... I would recommend everybody have, like, spend some time crafting up shells, have their ender chest ready, and have, like, nine. Because we're clearing a, a non insignificant amount of blocks, right? I don't know if I've got enough shells for that. Do you sell a bunch of spare shells, James, or did you convert all those? Uh, I have some. I got more. Right. I'm going to raid the mine o'clock area and see if I can't craft some extra shulkers for it. They're, they're in there, yeah. They're in the back, um, right side barrel. In the chest barrel? Ah, they're in the chest barrel. Very yeah. clever. All right, Uno, I've made you eight shulkers. Uh, Can you make you me a spare you... um, ender chest as well, actually? I've got a spare ender chest for you as well. How many um, How many do you have, James? Do you need me to make more? Um, I think I've got like five or six, so I don't know you can. I don't know if I have a lot of room for more right now, but I guess I can make some room here. Yeah, I, I have room, actually, if you want to make... Uh in this miscellaneous box as well. Oh, there's my ender chests. And some ender pearls. Right, I've made six for both of you. This rocket box is a lie. Uh, let's see how many spares I have. One, two, three, four. Like, you got six now. No, it's fine. Five. I have some that are in use. Oh, hey, look, there's a creeper right in the middle of our farm. Let's just get rid of that one. Goodbye. Wait, is this my slow touch? Yes. I mean, I also have all of these, yeah, these, um, ah, slabs on me that I'm going to need to get rid of. Here, I'll come, uh, I'll come grab those right now. Oh, sorry, Uno. There you go. Thank you. I would have made one, but I'm out. I haven't actually got any blaze at my base. I don't know why I'm carrying around that that shul or that shulker box with iron ingots is just random stuff. I don't know why I have them on me. Ooh, what a pretty room! All right, James, one sec. Here, uh, dump that inventory of slabs. There you go. Do you want these spare shulkers now, or are you good? I can take them, yeah. There you go, bud. Thank you. Okay. What's this shulker box for right here? Oh, that's another one of the spare ones for you. Oh, okay. <clears throat> All right. Oh, it was to make the lanterns. You're right. That's why. Oh, yeah. yeah. All those saw lanterns. Where'd Surge go? What? Where'd Surge go? I can, I can come back. All right. How are we doing on those uh, slabs? 
Uh, I was still waiting on the nether wall, so. Yeah, the nether wart's the big bottleneck. You because again, it takes uh, 11 minutes per harvest, right? <laughs> Pardon me. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm cooking. I'm cooking up a lot nether brick. Probably, uh, you know, 16 stacks at least, and the rest. Okay. I am almost to the point where I can't do anything more in here. Wah! Fine. Okay. Uh, oh, I can break. There we go. Okay. This room it's is beautiful. It, this room That's is new design. It's it's now still gas proof, but at least I've cleared up a bunch. Uh, I've got more slabs here. Oh, I've got one. Boop. That, that coal went less far than I expected. Yeah. I mentioned we're resor not as resource rich on the uh, the mine o'clock base as one would hope. I think there's a bunch of coal in the four chests in the house. Oh, up above. There's a secret wealth chest. Oh, I did. Thank you. I just miscalculated how much um, four pieces of coal could do. You can do 32. Yeah, I, I, I doubled that in my own head. Oh. Uh, mm. All right. Cool. Well, now I guess we'll wait. When Joe Kim gets on, we'll um, we'll head out. I mean, the other thing we could do is we could just start crushing things. Like, if you wanted to go with Uno and start disassembling the Bastion, we could go find it. I could just, like, sit and wait and do the boring part off, off camera. What boring part? Uh, like, literally waiting for Nether Wart to... Oh, that... <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. No, well, we can do that. Um... Actually, you know what the secret tech is? Uh, quick, log Joe in and uh, have her sit by the Netherworld farm. <laughs> Put it in a box? Actually, give me one second. Because, <laughs> um, yeah, I think the four of us should go smash down the... Uh, All right, bashing, Joe's logging I, in for us right now. Because I think that could be kind of fun. Yeah. Do, 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 do. Need a kelp farm for fuel? I think uh, Joe has a kelp farm at his base. Uh, Uno, I'm moving all the bricks out of this chest and into the box that you had a brick in, so they're all in one place. Yep. That's what I was going to do as well. Alright, well, we'll wait for this to happen. Let's, uh... I mean, we can probably get started even yeah. without Joe Kim, and he'll just join us when he gets here, right? Uh, yeah, I think he was just going to move his car, so he should be here in a second. Uh, I'm gonna go the look signs at signs are helping! I, I did it! I'm gonna go look at what <laughs> TQ's been doing. Look okay. at my wait. So this shulker is no, almost is full of nether brick. Nice, yeah. Yeah, again the, the bottleneck is wait, were you burning the wood here, Uno? All my no. hard work? No, I'm oh, burning okay. coal. Oh, I was terrified you were making charcoal and I was gonna be oh. really sad for a second. I was like, no. Look at that. The minute I said I'm gonna go check out TQ. She logs in. Which leads me to believe she's watching. Hi, TQ. I'm going to guess this is Lily Pad bridges to your house. Or or not. Has TQ actually done anything on the server yet? I actually don't know. I, too, do not know. I feel like... Wrong way. What? <laughs> How's that the wrong way? Yeah, the the path. Apparently, her base is not at the end of the her base. I mean, maybe this is just uh, maybe this is just naturally occurring. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that that naturally occurring uh, lily pad path. Yeah, you fell for the classic lily pad trap. 
Oh, I see something over there. Come on. <laughs> I'm gonna guess TQ has not put a lot of effort or time into the server yet. Wow, rude. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, that took me eight hours, man. Oh, dear. Have you got enough to replant? Yeah, I'm good. Anything that's in the chest is yours to grab. Oh, hey, look, there's stuff over here. Oh. Oh, this is much fancier. <gasps> Hold on, is this the Kitty. first time? Hold down tab, James. Yeah, that's everybody. That's everybody. All right, let's count seven. Wait. I count seven. Ten, Eighteen. What is... What's going on here? It's a fish farm. I'm stuck. Ah! Whoa, 55 diamonds. Look at you. All right. Later. Wait. Ow. Uh, Amber, a lamp light for five months. Thank you for the reset. All right. Uh, cool. Oops. Okay. Do we have lots of food at the MOC? Uh, I don't think we've got a huge amount. Got some. Got some. Okay. Clean up this inventory. This can go here. These can go here. Alright, Joe is now in position to be the world's greatest nether wart farmer. Okay, so this chest is a freaking mess. back. Right, so I've got another stack and a bit of uh, red nether brick. So I will slab it and then bring it back. These bricks, and these food. slabs. Uh, gimme, give gimme. Give okay. All right. Let's go. Hi. Is there a big sugarcane farm on the server yet? Uh, how much sugar cane do you need? Well, I'm just thinking for like rocket supplies. I'm wondering. All right, you're um, back. either me or Serge. I have I have just like a huge amount manual. And I'm then sorry, I, I didn't. Ones 
What what's the question? Sugar here? sugar cane. Sugar I can't farm. I do you need rockets? Yeah, like four rockets. I'm just I'm curious if there is a sugar cane farm. I have a bad one. Yeah, I have a I have compared to some of the other farms we have made. My sugarcane farm is lackluster. But yo, James, one sec. If as I say, if you go if you go to mine, I've got a loadout that's here. Grab you, your you grab your um your rocket box and take half of those. I'll just, I'm just gonna just take um, a row. I don't need half. Yeah. There you go. Thank you. Uh, yeah, no worries. Second, let me grab this. There we go. Much better. Okay. Um, actually, Uno, how many Elytra do you have? Uh, just the one. Here. There's a spare. Ha, I think it. That was for you. Uh, don't break that. Bam. Okay. Uh, I'm just gonna place the rest of these bricks. Joe, okay, you want to throw me thumbs so we can get this done? Uh, yeah, uh, you, I only have like a stack and a half left, so it's not a big deal. It ain't gonna get done, but uh, Joe, if you want to come meet us uh, in the Nether, we can go and. Eventually. Oh, so I don't know exactly where a Nether hub is. Uh, Bastion, you mean? Uh, Bastion is, but I know <laughs> it's right somewhere here. near this Nether hub as I kind of accidentally found it the other day. We all, I mean, we don't need, we can go find another one too if we if we want to leave that one around, because it's closest. I don't know so. why we would leave that one around. I don't know. Yeah, let's tear it down. Uh, all right. so everybody months. has food. Thank you. Everybody has rockets. Everybody has speller shulker boxes. Yeah. Everybody pee before we left. <laughs> I'm making a fire resistance potion just real fast, so. Oh, hey, Joe. All uh, right. Uh, I'm going to put this pickaxe in here for now. And I'm going to eat this at Surge. Grab some Wow, you're so generous. I like the one okay. torch we have in the corner here. Are you salt or the black salt? What do we do? Just because? Or? Sorry. Well, we want all the blocks and that's going to give us a nice mix of bricks and blackstone and gilded blackstone and maybe some basalt as well. Gilded blackstone is bad. I mean, basalt you can you can just generate. Uh, so. How dare you? Yeah. How how dare I be smart about our usage of <laughs> blocks? But the bastion is coming down. That's fair. And then we'll Down use, with the Bastion. Yeah, and then we'll use all the resources that we get from it in this build. Down with Bastion. Up with Reinhardt. <laughs> I'm down with this anti-Bastion meta. I mean, just play on a console. Bastion can't aim up, so... <laughs> <laughs> oh, is Bastion a dog? Is Bastion a dog on consoles? That's, that's the real thing. He can't aim up because he's too overpowered on consoles. So... <laughs> <laughs> Um, it's like Pharaoh just hard counters Bastion. Oh, wow. all right. Now we don't need to continue that conversation. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Sad on Nick noises. <laughs> I refuse to die to lava for a fourth time, so that's why I'm making these. All right. Have I burned to death yet? I don't think I have. I've had some pretty dumb deaths, but I don't think I've burned to death. I'd lose another pair of Elytra. Uh, one of you is forgetting their ender chest, and I think that one of you is James. It is James. I don't... <sighs> Fine. Um, all right. Okay, I'm on my way. Let's go find this thing. So I'm going to go to the, uh, the James Turner Memorial hole here. Ow. I tried to push you out. It didn't work so well. Did you try and kill me and fall again? Yeah. All right. Uh, spread out and look for clues. And by clues, we I found a bastion. Oh, what? <laughs> Where? Over here. Left? Oh. Don't. Oh. Uh, I'm at positive 70, negative 193. I can see you two flying around. Oh, here. Ah. Right. I, don't actually know, was... I don't even know if this one's been looted. 
Uh, oh, it's totally hidden. It's half buried. Yeah. If you didn't come, if you didn't uh, come at it from exactly that angle. Oh, I have mob who, sounds. Who off. exploded? Oh, there's a ghast. Uh, but I had I had the mob sounds off, so you only heard the explosion and not the ghast first part. Do you have a um, uh, hopper? Turn my hostile creatures back up. Oh, they're changing that, by the way. Just open it. They oh, they're gonna make the chests always spawn. It's on. been it's been looted. All right, let's find the top. We mine our way up. Don't mine your way up. My what? Let's get. Oh my god, this is huge. Yeah, dog. Yeah, this is a big one. Are you mad at me? Oh, they're mad at me. Lordy. That's that's a lot of lava there. There's these this is an interesting design some of these have. It's like lava blades. Ow. Ooh, ooh, a lodestone. Oh, nice. Okay, I guess I'm gonna mine my way up a little bit on this one. Don't mine your way up. <laughs> Shut up. Uh, another 1.16 change. Uh, they're going to allow you to do horizontal chains. Yeah. Oh, that's kind of cool. All right. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, screw it. Uh, We're just there... killing all the piglins, right? Yeah, I yes. would. All right. Uh, I guess let's just go. Well, let's make sure we're all at the at about the same height and we work down together. So I don't think is like, there, I'm not worried about it. Yeah. Is there like a I'm top? At 84. Uh, there will be a top, but it looks like the top is completely buried here. Yeah. Yeah, the top looks to be at about 94. Uh, wow. 94. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ooh, thorns. Okay. So... Yeah, I'm gonna work to actually expose the entire top of this thing. Yeah, that's what I was gonna try to do as well. Yeah, so let's let's make it like a perimeter. I, I like that idea. Okay, yeah. Ow. So that's just all basalt. Okay, yeah, there's still blackstone. Oh, something um just to all be on the same page as when we start. Uh these things can have multiple buildings. So you should probably go out a little bit further in a direction to see where those are. God, there's... Do we want to just take down one? Yeah, like if you come over this way, James, I just exposed another one. Yeah, there's... Do we want to just take down one or the whole thing? I mean, I mean, let's just start working, right? Let's just take down what we can sure. with basically what's left in the stream like an hour and a bit, so... Okay. Oh, my God. See anything else over here? Uh, should we all go down like two layers at a time? I don't know if it's that important. Oh my god, there's a hole here. Danger hole. Okay, it doesn't look like there's anything over this direction. So it's like all of this area. Uh, be really careful over in this corner when mining out the netherrack. Uh, there's a big old drop arena. Oh, I just realized something that I should do is get rid of this nether and we'll take that. I like that Joe's currently on fire. Yeah, it's fine. I'm a fire care. resistant <laughs> push. So, like, I very specifically did it for that, so. Okay, so we've got all that. Let's do this. And then, okay, so Blackstone's going to be by far the most popular. Okay, Cracked can go there. Uh, we'll go like this. Remember to silk touch the gilded stuff. You... Yeah, I'm using silk touch by default. Yeah. Okay, I think well, this is a good... by default, like a monster. Right. Nice. Whatever's I've got in my hand at the time. Yeah. Alright, let's go. Ah. There. God, yeah, this, so this thing goes where you are, Joe. What? You might... Uh, there's, uh, underneath the, uh, netherrack, there's a pretty large fall. Okay. Uh, build the cat! 75 months, welcome back! I 
I'm actually really excited to find out how much Gilded Blackstone we get from this. So apparently Gilded Blackstone is one of the rarest blocks in the game. Well, it's only in Bastion, right? Exactly. And, yeah. yeah. So, and I was pretty happy with like my 15 that I had, so. Yeah, and you should get a fairly good amount as we disassemble a Bastion. The issue is that they only spawn in Bastion, so. And you can't craft it or anything. Yeah, yeah, yeah you can. It's only in, uh... Can only find them and they get really mad at you when you uh grab them. oh gosh that's a lot of lava oh uh, this this is this is taller than i thought uh would this be easier with a beacon um probably not well, well no do we want, do we want effort. instant mining like yes always really like Dude, just the amount of money. danger okay okay fair but like the, the danger involved of like you might fall yeah. and die or also like, how do beacons work in things, so. the nether again you need to they go to the bedrock do, yeah yeah you because uh, uh, bedrock is technically transparent which is really weird but the issue is if you remember like an old mine o'clock stream sometimes netherrack can be invisible and hidden inside of right yeah yeah uh, just watch out in this corner as well, the, um... Am I already... There's a, a hole. Okay, I'm already full up. Wow, okay, so there's a lot more of... We're also probably getting a variety of stuff too, right? Oh, that's a big hole. Nope, I'm gonna go over here. I think the only thing, if you're digging over holes, make sure our blocks aren't full in lava. Okay, let's go like this and like this actually no like this and let's... careful lava leak i repeat lava leak there we go it's only you over there buddy all right here we go so if anybody's watching and wondering why we're doing this um because this is just a really easy fast way of getting all of these new uh especially the black rock um resource and because we want to use it as a building material in the big nether room. is going down. Yeah, it's just taking a while because lava. Plus, as you all know, uh, I only know digging in this game, so. Ah, uh, yep, that's terrifying. Even though I know that it's okay, still terrifying. Whew. You alright, bud? Yep. I definitely fell into lava. It's okay. <laughs> Do you think the potion I'm makes you complacent? Right. No, uh, not in any way. It is purely a. I, in case I screw up, I have a, a safety net, but it does not make me complacent. In case or when? Yeah, when? Because <laughs> me, so. Is there any lava under what I'm working on right now, Joe? Uh, no, you're fine. No. Just a drop. Um, there's, a, there's a big hole. Yeah. I That's guess um, the one thing we're actually going to get less of from here, I, well, you're still going to get a lot, but you're going to get a lot more stone than you are going to get just the, or you're going to get a lot more polished, like bricks and, and brick, stuff. Yeah. Than the actual black stone. But I think we should probably end up with a bunch of both. I feel like I got a ton of blackstone from doing the um, ancient debris hunting. Yeah, yeah, you definitely do. It's like by proxy of digging down there. So I mean, I'd rather. I, I'm not super keen stone. on using just the plain blackstone as much as I am like the polished and the bricks and stuff like that. Totally. And we get like interesting varieties. Are there cracked ones as well? Yes, polished. there are. There is cracked. Uh, yeah, 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 cracked blackstone brick. That, that just saves us time of not having to put it through a furnace, right? That seems fairly rare, and then I came over here and it's just everywhere, so... But now we've got this quality, high quality 5x5 five five minus 1. All right. <laughs> just think what we can do with that. Oh, there's... Ah, oh, that's not as bad as the thought. Has anybody found any gilded? Yes. I have yeah, not. Yeah, yeah. I, have I, not. I have one, though. Uh, yeah, I have a piece of gilded on me. Ah. Ooh, got some stairs. Heck yeah! 
Have we have we got any chests set up to empty? That's what that's, that's what shop. all the shulker boxes in your inventory are for, or in your ender chest are for. That's yeah. literally what we packed for. All right, I didn't know if we got one like any that were laying around. Nope, nope. Everyone is responsible for emptying their own inventory. Very well. So, Serge, remember a bunch of months ago you helped me make uh, a sorting machine and a facility for all of the products of my punch a chunk? Yeah. Uh, that's basically full. Uh, yeah. <laughs> so now I need. Now I'm going to make another one, but it's going to be a shulker loaded system. So I need oh to, yeah, those are really cool. I need to figure out how to build those. Uh, oh, should be. Okay. So it's interesting. Um, uh, do you want like the TLDR? Sure. You make the same item filter that you typically do. Yeah. On top. So it's going to end up being a lot taller. But you do. I think that's just like. I believe most people just call that the Impulse SV sorting system. Yes, I believe he was the first to make it like a big thing. Yeah. Yeah, so you make one of those and then load it on top. They're super cool. I've only made one of those so far in the season for string. Uh, and they they extend Ow. super well. Ow. So like you can, as easily <laughs> as you're making like the Impulse SV sorter, you can make a, a shulker loader beneath it. Yeah. Piglin, damn piglins hit hard. They hit super, and we're on hard mode, which makes it worse. Yeah. Like they hit yeah. three times. We don't even have the brutes yet. Well, oh, brutes gonna... are going to be super strong. Yeah, yeah. I, I don't thick. understand. I don't understand how they thought the Nether needed to be more difficult. Because real talk, I've uh, I've been like kind of low key. I've scared. been murdered. I don't enjoy going to Bastions because I just keep getting wrecked. Yeah, like the fact that there's yeah, four of us yeah. here makes this a lot easier. But I have been I have been bullied. Yeah. In Bastion, flat like, bullied, and oh, then like hoglins are super annoying. Oh, like... hoglins! So so they hit like, they hit like their, a truck. Their HP is unfair, and their their hitbox is weird. Yeah, that, that, I think that's the worst thing Hold about on. hoglins. Is the Can hit somebody boxes. take a second and walk over to where I am, and just look over the edge? Uh, we're about to make some people pretty angry here. <laughs> there's <laughs> there's a lot of them. I mean, they're already pretty angry. Are they yeah, all already hostile? Oh, yikes. If they weren't, they are now. <laughs> I mean, we can just take care of them. Like, yeah, see? I mean, James is aggro to them, so it's fine now. There, all right, we're they're, safe. they're all gone. <laughs> do they... Do they take damage from lava? Mm, no. I actually don't know. I would assume so. I have no so. idea. Question marks everywhere? Um, yeah. Didn't think they took damage from lava. Mm. I mean, maybe they, they do. Right, so. Cool. TIL. Uh, I also didn't know that Hoglins become zombified in the overworld. Yeah. yeah. Hoglins. Yeah. yeah. Isn't that a sick. really? Isn't they that a really cool, cool bit of yeah. lore? It basic means like we're hell for them. Ooh. Oh god dang. Why don't we become zombified when we go into the nether though? Maybe we are. Maybe you just don't don't know it because of the skin you're wearing. But but does all the zombies have bones and stuff exposed? Is all my right. skin too fresh, too clean? Clearly. Okay. That's a big hole. Yeah, things are going to start getting kind of interesting here. We made good progress, though. With four of us, that probably helps, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Imagine doing this solo. Oh, my God. I don't think I would. No. Uh, the other thing is that, like, the super real risk of death again, right? We really should have set up respawn anchors. I keep forgetting that they're a thing. Uh, I'm going to try and go down and deal with all this lava. Oh, I mean, I have a, a thing at my like, base. If we want to set up a, um, a respawn point. 
Yeah, it's fine. I'm not too concerned. He says. <laughs> he uh, says terrifying. Who has, all right, who has money on James dying first of us for? Yeah, all right. We're going to need uh, mods. Can we set up a straw poll? Yeah, for let's, get a, yeah. let's get a bet going. Uh, Slash loser has polls. to pay out gift subs to the others, so. Alright, um... Uh, build a cat, 75 months. I think I already got that, but... Congratulations, that's a long time. Okay. <laughs> I bet on James killing another player so that he avoids being the first death. See, Fugi knows me well. That's cheating. Yeah, but technically within the rules. Yeah, it's, <laughs> it's only cheating well, if we yeah. if we lay forth some rules, and we haven't yet. So, all right, I'll, hold on, kill James real fast. Ah! <laughs> You're the one that was willing to break them. All right. If anybody knows all about the rules. That's yep. scary. It's fine. I'm a ding dong. Ooh, okay. Uh, Brett is best. 23 months says hi. Hi. Brett is best. Ow. Why am I on fire? I do not. Did you walk into lava? This place I is huge. Comment. Did James hit you with a flaming arrow? No. Or a flaming sword? I did not. The real key <laughs> would I'm be so sorry. that James I... killed himself on thorns. Turns out <laughs> that while I'm holding, um, like, shift and climbing on the edge of a thing, I don't have the extra hand required to get to my mute button in case I sneeze. <laughs> okay. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Getting a lot of cracked stuff now. That's good. Get that crack break. Okay. Uh, I, that means something else, buddy. I believe... Oh, no. Never mind. There's actually quite a lot of lava down here still. Uh, is anybody above me and able to throw down like a stack of net? Oh, never mind. I have a stack of netherrack on me already. You can't. You can't just dig. I'm in the See? middle of the. <laughs> you know, I'm in the middle of the right directions now. anywhere. Yeah. Just, just go to the edge. Yeah. Oh, just, take, just take a quick. Take a quick. I'm doing the hard and... work right now in the bastion, oh. putting out the lava. And wow, I ask wow, for a wow. hand, and instead I get a bunch wow, of whiners. Wow. Just a bunch no, of whiners. You want a if you yeah. want a round of applause. Yeah. What do you What do you want? <laughs> Make up your damn mind. Sir, sir, I, sounds I, like I the Charlie Brown parents. I wanted some netherrack. Wow, I was wow, fairly wow, clear. Wow, wow, wow. <laughs> no respect. It's true. It's true. James asked me to show up, and I think that was his first mistake. So. <laughs> Go God. Oh, that almost sounded like a James death. No, it's fine. I just... Can't be too sure about what any of these drops are going to mean for you. Uh, okay, so I'm full up on brick again, so... That's lava. There's so much brick. Okay, cool. Okay. Wait, why am I picking up the... Oh, I'm not. Okay, good, good, good. Damn Hawkland down there. Why do you need all this blackstone? We're going to be using it for the um, big nether hub piglin trading area that we're building. It's a cool new block. And we might as well build with it. And everyone in the history of my Minecraft content creation is using it, so we have to as well. I mean, it'd be rude not to. Yeah, it's the new stuff, right? Yeah, it's play the... with the new stuff. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. How does one check out the new content in a game like Minecraft if you don't craft it with it? Ow. It's like, we are now mining it, and then we will craft it. Yep. Check and mark. <laughs> 
check mark. There's a there's a question mark step in there somewhere, and then a profit step too. So. Ah, check. Oh no, Joe! Oh, no! No! Oh. The first death was secretly Joe all along. <laughs> All right, who had their money on Joe dying yeah. first? Oh my god! <laughs> I, I I I tried to file that bug report last week <laughs> from the Nether Ward farm. Oh, I guess there yeah, technically said, isn't. Yeah, I, I said that, and you were like, "No, just use your Elytra." I mean, yeah. <laughs> Oh, this is the darkest timeline. I guess we could build a ladder out back. Oh, that's fair. Whatever. I blame Surge. That's fair. I, like I, was, the, the I was the lead designer. He was, like the call himself. He, he was the architect, yeah. <laughs> <sighs> didn't didn't factor in people not wanting to use Elytra. Yeah, I mean, I, I don't, I don't have an elitron right now. It's beneath surge. You don't have an elitron right peasants. now. You're gonna fall to your death. What is wrong with ah. you? What is wrong with people who don't just wear their elitra all the time? I'm wearing chest armor for when the piglin inevitably decides that I've looked at it funny. Well, you can also just fly away if that happens. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they can't hit you. If they can't reach you. Forehead. Uh, this is a faithful. Yeah. Like this, this piglin here. You see, just dodge, smile. <laughs> this is a faithful texture pack. Uh, you can get it at faithful Sorry, dot team. I'm, I'm hanging out with Adam too much. You see that one? Oh god my damn. god! See, you could have flown away. I, I did try to save you. My bad. All right. Well, good news is, uh, I have all your stuff. Cool, cool, cool. All right, current deaths are two. <laughs> I love you, TQ. <laughs> this is what you get for messing with nature. Yeah, that's, 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 uh, that's all Minecraft is. Yeah, I hate to tell you this. I don't know if a structure counts as nature, though. Yeah, this is not nature. This is this pig, is a this building. Is, this is piglin built. Somebody made this. Yeah. Ooh, Jesus, that scared me. Oh, there's uh, some good picks. Oh, yeah, you got them. Okay. I'm collecting his stuff, yeah. Okay. I'd like to stop falling down holes. <laughs> Is that like a 2020 goal? Hey, or? That, uh, that chest plate did a whole lot of good for you, didn't it? Buddy? <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. There's boots here. I would have died so much sooner. <laughs> Where are the boots? Oh, I see them. Ah, ah. died a lot quicker. Okay. We made a moat to keep this. You could have also just flown away. Idiot pig on the other side. Well, we have one point of data of, you know, pig fighting to pig while equipped with armor. And then, you know. Oh, you know what we get? We get the pig face blocks. Yes. Oh right! I forgot. Sometimes there's hidden gold bars in this, uh, in the build. If you ever find a wall that's covered in pig faces, there's sometimes a block of gold hidden behind it. There we go. That's everything. Okay. Let's go. There was a there was a brief moment where I realized I don't have a spare pickaxe in my uh, in any of my shulkers. Well, both What's of that? yours is here because I have. Do you have a shovel on you? Because I can't find that. But uh, no, I don't think I bothered with okay, the shovel. Okay, then I have everything else. I think I have pants, hat, chest, feet, elytra, sword, two picks, and a bow, and then food. Would you believe that bow was a random roll? Really? That's horseshit. <laughs> Yeah, that was that wow. was a random roll. That's a really good random roll. What'd you get? Power unbreaking infinity punch two. Wow, that's a yeah. Yeah. That's impressive. That is a that is a deep what the f who did this? Oh, I found uh more of your stuff. Uh 
mainly your rockets. And your golden boots. I assume these golden boots are yours? Probably. Don't stand there, pig. Okay. Uh, where am my stuff? It's in the in chest. One of the big chests. The, the double yeah, chest the down there. Chest. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Oh, sorry. The small chest has a bunch of black rock. I should probably put that in a shulker. I kind of like how the basalt in this build looks like teeth. Oh god, not again. It doesn't. No, there's definitely a room that is supposed to be look, look like a face, and the basalt is teeth. Like, have you flown around the outside of these before? Yep. And you ah, don't think it looked like face. teeth to you? No. Huh. Uh, Alright. How are we doing here? Oh, uh, someone pick up my ender chest. Yes, I picked up your ender chest. Sorry, I just realized I had an extra one. Cool. Do I have crap? Yeah, I do. Wow, there's a lot of crap here, actually. Uh, I'm looking. For You're you. over this way. Hold on. Let me try and get out. Yep, there you are. Thank you. Yeah. That's yeah, a hoglin. Uh, all right, I am going to take another quick break, folks. Um, Y'all can keep Just uh, working careful. away. There's a lovely big hole down here now. Uh, a litter of alternative for 12 months, the one year. Thank you so much. All right. Um, yeah, hold tight. I'm just going to take a quick uh, commercial break, and I will be right back. Don't go anywhere. Open your shulker boxes and Yo. ender chest. And, and ender they'll also the, see yeah. that as an act of hostility towards them. We're back. So, welcome back. That was very friend. brave of you, bud. To just uh, AFK in the open. Yeah, that's fine. What's the worst that could happen? So many things. Where do I begin? Wait, what's yeah. this? What's this block? It's a side profile. Oh, there's a polished basalt, maybe? Yeah, that's a polished basalt. Good. Oh, that's where it used to be lava, but I cleared that. Forgot. Thanks, Path Surge. Forgot hey, that this those next were layer is uh, the, the ceiling of a floor, so just be careful. Or the ceiling of, a, of another room. Oh, no, Uno, don't go that way. Don't unearth another structure. Let's just pretend that didn't <laughs> exist. Wait, what? There's another entire building over here where Uno... Oh my no. god. Not, no, 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 no. I, oh, I'm walling look at it all off. That. Yeah. No, no, stop it. Stop it. I'm walling it off. It doesn't exist. No, we have to. It's the rule. So what rule? We're, like we're taking down the whole we we're taking down the whole bastion. We can't just leave is it. it. Is it just to say that we did it or yes. like cuz I don't think we're going to okay, I mean, perfect. now it is to say that we did it. All right. Let's find the let's find the whole thing here then. I mean, how many all right, people All James, I have a question for you. Ah, ah, oh god. <laughs> I learned something very important about you the other day. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> that so if you get attacked gonna... by a penguin, you can escape using your I rocket. I did! <laughs> I'm blaming my lag on that one. Uh, I'm blaming my lag on that one. All oh right. my god, it goes uh, up further? Can anybody, who's in charge of grabbing Joe's stuff? I, I will. Okay. So James, I learned something very interesting about you the other day. Uh-huh. You have strong opinions about Nan bread. What? I mean, I I mean, y yes. I I don't have strong opinions of non non bread. I just think that the non from Four Spice is nowhere near as good as the non from Tandor. But there therein lies your opinion on this. What what about it? Didn't you like? It's not as how, how do you mess up non bread? It's, it's not as uh fluffy. It's it's a lot thinner. It's a heck of a lot chewier. It was adequate day of, un it, unedible, uh, on uh, leftovers. 
so like here's the question i have for you then like what is and i guess this is the the question i'm going to ask everyone here what is the ideal nan texture then is it is it supposed to be super soft i i prefer like, it super the soft? texture the texture you like is almost like a soft shell taco is is the way i could describe to the people who aren't aware of the differences in non what what james is looking for uh, as but, opposed but to something there, there, right that's just weird I mean, but you, as opposed to something firmer like a ciabatta. But I mean, you know exactly. You you know exactly what non I like because you've had the non I like, right? Like. So if, if, if Joe, given if if given the option, though, I, I'd always go for a paranta. Don't change the subject. Non. Yeah, no, non is <laughs> way better. Non's way better. Nah. Get, get out of here. Yeah, sorry, yeah, sorry, yeah. Uno. Sorry, uh, you're just wrong on this one. Sorry, buddy. <laughs> now, Joe, you're very knowledgeable when it comes to food stuff. Yeah. Like, professionally working in kitchens and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. I mean, obviously, we have different opinions when it comes to bacon. But tell me, yeah, soggy tell me all your thoughts bacon. on Yes, non. correct. Saki bacon is the best bacon. Hands yes. down. Yeah, hands down. <laughs> yeah, not, not, it's not even a question. <laughs> I, but the word Sorry, soggy is just so unappealing. Yeah, okay. but yeah, I mean, soggy is a bad, bad word I'm to a, use. I'm, but... a, I'm, a, I'm a medium rare bacon kind of person, I guess. I want to say here, but let's talk. Let's talk back, back to yeah, non. Okay. Okay, okay, you, okay. you are, you are um, thinking of bacon, you know, that's not that stuff that you know can kill a man. That the the the, the U.S. gets. Where the ding dang heck are we again? Sorry. Uh... Uh, the coordinates are positive 100, negative 150. There's some junk in here. Uh, so yeah, like, is there an an ideal of what is what is the perfect concept of non bread here? So I so I am not someone who has made non bread. I've eaten a lot of it in various places. All right. Uh, so as the current authority of non bread, that's perfect. So not <laughs> how that works. Hold on, I need to try to fly to you guys without dying. Like it should have good pull. It should um, absolutely have good pull. It's 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 should should hold up to being dipped. Yes. Yeah, and, it's something and, I like, don't like. You use it use you... it as a utensil, even right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But, like if it's so, too soft, if it's yeah. too soft, you end up just you end up getting curry all over your, your hands, right? You bite into it and it falls apart, and it's just a giant mess. So like, I don't know. Yeah, soft and But fluffy. I understand yeah. where James is coming from, because if it's too tough, then when you go to pull it apart, you bite or pull too hard, and you get curry. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You don't want it chewy. You don't want it too chewy. I don't know. I was just shocked that James gave just, like, the lowest imaginable score on this place. And I think it's, I think it's I, fine. You know, just on the non, though, right? Like, I, I think their butter chicken, and that's the only thing I've had from them, was legit. And to be honest, I think it actually, like, upon, like, even on the second day, it was still, I think this, because that's the thing, right? Is that when you, when you judge, when I judge a takeout meal, with the exception of, say, like, tacos. If I go get tacos, I'm eating all the tacos. And I'm not saving yeah. them. But if I get Indian... Yeah, there's some Indian, things that just don't... Yeah. yeah. If I get Indian, I'm going to eat half Indian. now and half the next day. And um, the 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 curry, the butter chicken, was fantastic the next day. Um, the naan just wasn't. It was just not good. James, can I have an arrow? Uh, yes. Uh, Are we all... Fact, hold I, on. Yeah. Are we all on the same page of lowering the structure floor by floor? Yes. So, like, we should come back and do the whole area? Yes. Or are we doing, like, little sections here? I, I've just I'm been going layer by layer, because that's, yeah. again, right. kind of what I know. Yeah, I'm sort of working <laughs> to... Their whole brand. I'm, I'm kind of feeling like a reverse 3D printer. Yeah. Um... I mean, there are worse things to be. Yeah, I mean, a reverse dot matrix would be weird. Yes, it would. Did you get all your stuff, Joe? Yes, I believe so. I, that's all I could find, but there's probably some stuff that's I still might be follow. missing a shulker box or two, but that's about it. Perfect non, and then... Okay, hold on. I want to see this photo TQ has just posted. Yeah, that's some good-looking non. You throw yeah. it on the screen, that I looks can't delicious. see your photo. That looks delicious. Uh, it's on the wrong... Oh, no, I could actually throw it on. Hold on. Uh, sit, wait, can I just do this? Nope. 
Can I do this? Yep. And then I go like this. Bam! There you go. There we go. <laughs> I'll just I'll just leave that here. Oh, interesting. There we go. That's a little bit thicker. Interesting. I mean, you know what's better That's than me? That's probably about the right no, thickness, but that, that looks too <laughs> light for me. I like mine a little more burned, but that looks good. Yeah, I want a, I want a darker, a darker non red. Oh god, big pig, big pig. Ow, you hurt so hard. Anyways, uh, now I'm a uh, picture of non, which I think is a much better uh, stream experience for everybody. <clears throat> oh no! You fell. How dare you? I fell. You know another thing I'm gonna do? I'm actually gonna go back and remove some of this netherrack. Alright, there we go. Uh, yeah, we, we, we've been leaving some floating islands here, so I'm trying yeah, to go back and... It, yeah. <laughs> a lot of people watching the stream don't even know what a dot matrix printer is. Uh, that's fair. So, Serge, I'm going to say um, let's maybe do pulled pork poutine another day. What? Um, I'd like to do one on a day when uh, Ashley can be around and I can split because I do not uh, I do not need to eat an entire pulled wait, pork poutine. Are you hostile with me? No, you're not. And we can't really share food right now. So, yeah, because ah, I, uh, I, I would have no I'm problem dead, I'm sharing dead, it with I'm you, dead. but we can't. You're no, fine. No, I understand. No, I'm not. Oh, no, I'm not. No, I'm not. Oh my god. Oh no! <laughs> That's right. another one that came up. Alright, Serge, it's your turn to get all the stuff. Alright, I'll yeah, put gold on. I didn't think I needed it, but I'll put gold on. They're also wearing your stuff. Oh. <laughs> well, that's awkward. Wait, you weren't wearing gold? No, I didn't oh think. I thought god. we were just killing everything anyway, so it didn't matter to me. But even still, that's then you just don't have the element of surprise. Ow, I fell down a hole. I'd love to pull pork poutine. All right. Um, you try to clear customs and say that, <laughs> that you're coming up for for poutine, and maybe they'll deem it essential travel. Yeah, you really uh, can't can make somebody, food free on. Can somebody double check? Um, okay, it's just my gear this time, and um, where Joe died. All my, all my uh, shulker boxes away. So this this place is huge. You're the one that wanted to take the whole thing down. Yeah, because it's kind of a cool cool thing to be able to say we've done. Alright, I think I got everything there. Alright, well, I have gold on now, so they won't arbitrarily attack me, sorry. Okay, let's... I mean, it's oh, hardly arbitrary. I don't have mob sounds on, that's why I didn't hear uh -huh. it. Yeah. yeah, that'll do it. Okay, this one's full, right? Yeah, so this, this shulker is full. But let's empty. Is this shulker full? No, not even close. I think this might have actually been one of Joe's shulkers. Actually, Joe, um, yes. <clears throat> I need to I need to repair one of my picks, so I might as well just bring all this stuff to you in the sure. hub. So if you want to meet me at the entrance, let's put this away. And um. Anyways, yeah. The good news is it's easier and easier to get into this now. Ow! Oh, oh god. Alright, if you get into the nether hub, Joe. Okay. There's gonna be a shulker box waiting for you there that has all your stuff in it. Ow. I don't even think the baby's hurt. Seems but... seems kind of it. Get out of here. Go out of here, dumb. Can hear a gas kicking around as well. The the babies are odd because they show up very aggressive and then you fight back and they're like, "What? No, I'm innocent." And you're like, "How dare you?" you <laughs> yeah, I didn't mean yeah, this. they definitely start the fight and then you tap them and they run away. Yeah. So. Uh, all right, I got my first piece Same of with the blackstone. Are we talking the piglins or the hoglins? Because I just saw Hoglins. an excellent comment in chat. You want a pita? That's what you want. You don't want nan. You want a pita. No, I want I, I I want non. You want a the super 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 soft thing. 
yeah. Yeah, but... you see, when you're talking about pita bread, are you talking about the, like, big round ones, or are we talking, like... Because pita bread's here. Uh, sort of semi-hard, and you, you, you heat them up, and then you cut them open, you put things in them. And they're, like, oval-shaped. Again, I just, but, I just want... Like, super, super, super soft. You just want a vessel to hold your food. I mean, sort of. Again, I mean, I just want, like... I just want sizzling tandoor naan, right? Like that's that is that is a good naan. Sizzling tandoor naan is good naan. I agree. Is is a good naan. And I'm non. talking more like Greek pita, right? Not like pita pit pita. Oh God, pita pit. There's a thing I haven't think I've thought about in years. Mm, delicious. God, pita pit. There used to be a big fan of Loading Ready Run who worked at the pita pit in town. Pita Pit's also where Greek, you would go. Greek Pita's pretty similar to Naan, just not as... It's just too doughy. But that's what I mean. That, that, yeah. That's what James is yeah. looking for. He's looking for that that soft, soft, soft Sure, dough. it is soft, but it is very doughy comparatively to what Naan yeah. to be. Yeah. I, 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 <laughs> here, Pita's, like, not not doughy, not, not soft. It's kind of tough. So you know what the best part of this whole conversation is? Mm-hmm. I've got leftover curry for we're, lunch. I was going to say, we're pissing off TQ. Oh. <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't... But... I should figure out what I'm going to have for lunch. I mean, I'm sad we're not going for poutine. I yeah. wonder if we went, if we could ask them to split it. Yeah, I mean, right? Put in two containers, they probably, yeah. they probably would, so. actually. And that way, that way, we don't have to have too much food. All right, I'm back. Not having too much food. Uh, I don't know that that concept means. I'm back. Oh, I'm oh, wearing gold. Speaking of food, watch out! There's a big hole in here. Now I'm excited because I'm making. We're making blueberry pancakes for dinner tonight. I'm excited Ooh. for blueberry pancakes. Dinner pancakes? Yeah, I man. like it. Dinner pan. I mean, I was gonna actually make them this morning, but I slept terribly last night, so I. Oh, uh, did you? Uh, I wasn't up early enough to make. Oh, is it all that losing pancakes. in Valorant we dated, or? I won a whole bunch of Valorant. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. <laughs> Thank you very much. I'm gonna play some more though. God, I really like that game. Season two came out today, and the the new battle pass looks sick. Oh, I need to. I didn't realize they uh, were immediately going into season two. Oh yeah, it's live. Okay, so I definitely know what I'm gonna do today. Do you stream uh, today, Jokim? Are you? Yeah, I do. Are you um, gonna play Valorant or? I was planning on maybe Valorant, maybe Paper Mario, so I wasn't sure. Well, if you Valorant, I will be there. Oh, hey, let's make little bridges to each other from these two islands. Yeah, Killjoy is not out yet. Deathmatch is not out yet. But season two ranked and um, what's it? Are those new the skins out? out? So, no, I can't remember. Mm -hmm. Oof. Oh, ah! that's bad, bad, bad lava, bad lava. I was over here minding my own business, and you came over here and hit one block and exposed lava. <laughs> I see what you did there. Mining your own business. Hey oh. <laughs> hey. Oh gosh. Oh, gosh. Okay. Is this is this building nearly done? No. Uh, no we're God, no. so we're like maybe the top third. Uh I no, think I mean this this one on our side. Oh, I don't know. Oh god no. No, uh, I think it goes, goes down so, to like 60. So, yeah. Ah! yeah. I think it goes farther. <laughs> okay, I that thought chest. 60 was lava. That chest was filled with crap. <laughs> 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 God damn it. Whoever did that sucks. Is that a chest full of netherrack? Yeah. That uh, might have been me. <laughs> it's probably me. <laughs> I was like, why is this still just hanging out here, busted open? Spews out crap. Ah, that's why. <gasps> uh, all right, don't need that. So hold on. Uh, so James and I are the only two who haven't died yet. Okay. Yeah. We'll fix that right now. Like, get out of uh, here. I'm doing well. I'm happy. Yeah, it can it can be arranged. Yeah, uh, that's easy. Oh, leave me alone, mom. You can say that I'm a bully because I will agree that I am a bully. <laughs> that's that's in my in my wheelhouse. So 
Um, Druj, Nasu, thank you for the 34 months. Uh, Zidian for five. Maelstrom, Solanair, 31. Says, nah, nah. And Star Wars, THX 1138 for 18 months. Breakfast equals, breakfast for dinner equals best dinner. I agree. Pancakes and bacon, gonna be good. Pancakes and bacon? And Ooh. bacon is Pan only a breakfast food because of a marketing ploy. Yep. So Pan decadent. Pancakes and soggy bacon. Yes, I'm so happy you like soggy bacon. It's well, the best. I need you to It'll do be... two things. One, you should probably change your profile picture to bacon now, now that non-talk is over. And two, we need to agree <laughs> on a different term for that bacon that no. isn't soggy. Soggy bacon is I just totally the forgot best that the non was there. there. Yeah, no. <laughs> <laughs> I, meant, I meant for that to be like I meant for that to be like a 30 second joke and then I just totally forgot oh my god I'm like that for like five minutes now that's funny I'm an idiot uh, um like are we are we talking just soft bacon yeah exactly yeah, there are yeah. so many better appetizing words could you imagine going to a restaurant to like how'd you like your bacon prepared uh I mean, no, Chris I, 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 when, I, when, I, I, go, when I go to a diner, I say soggy bacon. They know exactly I, what I mean. So I say, that's a, I that's say, are you talking back? Are you talking back bacon? American yeah, bacon. 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 American bacon. No, no, no. no, no, no. no, no, no. no you you garbage, see, UK bacon. Ba so. Yeah, strip bacon. Hey, look, Danish bacon. <laughs> Danish bacon's <laughs> best bacon. Uh, I say floppy too. Floppy bacon. Floppy. Right. So like, basically, just not. I hate, I don't I don't want crispy I don't bacon. Know if it's crispy, crunchy, unless it's in a sandwich. And even then, I probably would still. No, I still bacon. prefer floppy bacon. Yeah. 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 Like well, that, just, that... but people who burn it to a crisp are wrong. Yes. The stuff, the stuff that you know that that stuff when it's burnt to a crisp and it, it, it that's banned by the Geneva Convention. Right? <laughs> <laughs> I think at that point you just enjoy a texture. You don't enjoy a flavor. Yeah, because it's it's destroyed. It's delicious. It's like it's not good anymore. It just shreds your, the roof of your yeah. mouth. Like, and the, he said, I like crispy edges and a soft center. Exactly. Soggy bacon. I, yeah. I mean, that's just cooked bacon. That's just normally cooked. <laughs> like, properly cooked. No, I know so many people uh, that flaccid bacon, much perfect. prefer burnt bacon. So. So, yeah, flaccid's way worse. So. Yeah. Oh, God. <laughs> Way wow. turgid bacon. Hold on, a moist. How about yeah, that? Just nice, moist. nice. I bacon. don't mind the word moist. So no. yes, that's fine a, ni too. a nice moist, flaccid piece of bacon. Yum mm, yum. Delicious. <laughs> thing, thing is, I don't want my bacon wet. Wop it on your plate. Yeah. No, you damp off I... that grease. So I mean, the oh, way that I make it, the way that I make mix bacon. It with my egg and eat it. Yeah, like the way I make my bacon is I'll fry it up. And then generally I'll put it in the oven to keep it warm while other uh, things are going. Yes. And that helps uh, uh, cook it up a little bit more. So I didn't hear gas. Never mind, got it. So oh, interesting, like the opposite way a restaurant will typically do it is they'll start it in the oven so that it's cooked and then they'll finish it to yeah. give it a bit of a crisp well, yeah. on what, the pan. Well, Gen they'll pre-cook. Uh, pre -cook exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Like 80% cook, you know, 30 yeah. pounds of it at once well, like, and then just finish it so the line's faster. Like bacon day on the restaurant was the best day. 90% so. of the time I'm making bacon, we're I'm making like a scramble. Um, uh, so what I'll do is I'll fry the bacon in the pan and then I'll use all of the like fat and grease to cook the potatoes in. Sure, delicious. Yeah, yeah, that's um, the best way to do it. Yeah. Also, James, your mob sounds are off according to chat. So. Yeah, oh, they are too. Thank you. So at the parsonage, we'd buy an entire like side of bacon, not pre-sliced. So one of the best things about bacon cooking day at the parsonage, which with the amount of bacon they go through is like every lot, other yeah. day, honestly, yeah is you'd get um, bacon ends, which the cooks would just like fry up to you as well. So instead oh, yeah. of nice- bacon ends are so Oh my good. God, right? Bacon ends, right? bacon ends are the unsung hero of bacon. Truly, yeah. really. And this is one of those, like, like the little things that you you miss when you work in a kitchen, right? Like yeah. little treats, oh my God. That's so good. Okay. And like, like rib tips. Oh, man, oh rib tips, tips are also very amazing. Good. So, Jones Barbecue, a place in Victoria that we, you know, we're talking about pulled pork routine, does burnt ends sometimes oh, too. And like, right? Right? Holy moly, that sounds so good. Chicago yeah, is actually yeah. famous for the rib tips. So I'm like, I, I've fortunately been eating a lot of those, but oh man, I love me some good rib tips. Welcome to food chat. Yeah. yeah what, what, what do we do today? Uh, sorry, we, uh, that's my bad. I, no, 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 no. I, I had to talk to, I had to confront James on his non opinion. <laughs>
More like non-opinions, am I right? Uh, Ooh, roasted. Bam. Look, all this, all this chat, it's half past eight, I haven't had dinner yet. Yeah, yeah non's good. Then you started talking about Yorkshire pudding, and I wanted Yorkshire pudding. Yeah. Uh, Yorkshire pudding's so good. Yeah. I've only good had Yorkshire pudding once, and it was okay, so maybe... Do you like the... It was, it was probably badly made. Do you like the little ones, or do you like the giant fluffy ones? I like, I like, I like the little ones. Okay. Now you see a giant, a giant Yorkshire pudding, and then you put the stew in it. Yeah, I mean, you fill it. Yeah, that's we call that. I mean, I don't know what if you have. If, we just literally that's like a Yorkie is what they're called here. That's weird. The Yorkie's a chocolate bar. Also a dog. And a dog, yeah. yeah. But like, um, like there's a few pubs that will do like a massive, like basically they'll do a roast beef dinner. But they'll just jam it or into a giant in Yorkshire, Yorkshire pudding. pudding. Yeah. Oh, that sounds good, actually. That's yeah. pretty yeah. close to the Yorkshire pudding. That was so bad. Joe has banned me from ever being able to go back to what was one of my favorite pubs. <laughs> oh, oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. Yeah, it's been, it's been seven years. I really miss their chicken wings. But I'm not allowed to go back because it, it was a Yorkshire pudding so bad it has offended Joe. Oh, she's coming into the office and is confronting me for <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I Joe. mean, she's probably going to say, you can go to the restaurant. I'm just not going to go. I mean, yo, right. okay, I yo, 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 we, have, we have since found better wings as well, which is maybe enough. It's true. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to throw out a controversial... Uh thing that people's nans may have done, but Yorkshire pudding with jam. Oh yeah, I've, I've had good? that. It's buttery Sweet and delicious, and right? Sweet and savory. Yeah. Mm. Wait, what is this block? What I mean, it, it, a Yorkshire oh, pudding, it's, it's just a... Oh, uh, you've probably I found a pig head. Yeah, I definitely did. Wait, where's the gold? This may have already been looted. I guess, so yeah. Somebody may have it, taken the... I, I don't think they could have. This was like, it's buried. I don't understand. Why am I not picking? Oh, these are different. Even more so. No, I need to empty out my inventory. But then, from a Yorkshire pudding, it's only a hop, skip, and a jump to toad in the hole. That's true. What is a toad in the hole to you? Um, like he's in a basket. It's, now hold on. It's kind of like something different too. So what? sausages. Hold on. Sausages in sort of a batter. Uh, kind of like, kind of like if you had a Yorkshire pudding, but. Excuse had sausages you baked a corn into the pudding. Do so you what? have a hot dog? No, 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 it's a big, it's a big wide thing. Like a sausage? Yeah. No, Yorkshire pudding and Yorkshire pudding mix embedded with sausages. Is that that's like what I was going to say. Like there might be an interesting uh, difference in terminology here, John. Oh, interesting. Hmm. I've yeah. But it, it, it's like a like a Yorkshire pudding. Eggy in a basket, so. Yeah, Exatrix um, ex uh, posted it in uh, the Wikipedia article. That's uh, Ted in the Hole. Oh, interesting. Yeah, different, eh? All right, that, now, Joe, what's your what's your experience with a toad in a hole? My, so it's uh, eggs in a basket or a bullseye. There's a couple different yeah. names for it. Yeah. So that's what I've always been told it's called. So um, where you take a nice big slice of bread, you cut out a hole, and then you fry an egg inside of it. In the with middle butter. of it, right? Yeah. Yeah, and then that's super unbelievably delicious. Yeah. It's not it just is. eggy bread. <laughs> I know. No, eggy bread, <laughs> eggy bread is... You're thinking like French uh, toast is French eggy toast. bread. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah. Eggs in a basket is way better. Also, Can I tell you my favorite breakfast food that's very decadent, we don't have all that often? It's, uh, it's French toast with a cinnamon bun. And then oh. you just put like that cream cheese glaze on it too. Oh mm, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's that's the good stuff. Oh, that's God. when you know you've okay. been good. Or actually, like, actually I just starving this. now. Actually, just starving now. Yeah. <clears throat> All right. How are we uh, how are we doing here? I'd say we are somewhere between one and five percent done. <laughs> <laughs> I think we're further than that, but I do think oh, dang, there's dang it. Oh. a tremendous amount more to this thing. I opened a chest and now they're mad at me. Hold on. Wait, there were I chests I have had Joe dine three times. Shush, shush, shush. I'm fine. Oh. I, I heard it this time, so. Hello, large pig lad. Mm, pig lad. All right. Oh, if you kill them with a bow. 
You can get the experience. Ooh, the mending. Uh, I'm gonna... Did that one just... Oh! A hoglin just punted a piglin off a cliff to its death. That's so metal. They do have they do have little scraps. Hoglins yeah. and piglins. And... Yeah, despite both having tusks, they're not on the same side. Mm. It's sad, really. But I, they I have so much in common, yet they focus on their differences. Is... <laughs> uh, so, sometimes they're like quite happy together, and then sometimes they just I don't know what happens. Yeah, what's what is the catalyst that starts their conflict? Yeah, actually, I mean, I don't know. I think like they get too close or something, and then they just start murdering each other. Because I, I I don't I don't imagine that a hoglin is going looking at a chest or breaking gold. Yeah, our creds on the same. <laughs> Jesus, <laughs> right, Jesus dude? Look up. That's that's what's going on there. That's... Oh, I still have the toad of the whole page up instead of chat. <laughs> I looked oh, over and I was like, be toad of the whole. That's probably oh, up there. Okay, well, at least as we get farther down, they're uh, gonna die instantly, right? Like, piglins okay. hunt hoglin for sport. Wow. Also very metal. I saw a uh, a farm to farm hoglins, by the way. That was very interesting. Really? Cause, yeah, because you just send them off the send them off an edge with the blue mushroom, and if you put lava, they make you get pork, right? Oh, so you get pork cooked leather. pork. Yeah, oh, you, yeah. you do trap doors, right? Like so, they yeah. spawn, and then you yeah. have mushrooms. I I can actually picture exactly. Exactly, how that it's would super work. easy. When you, when you think about it, you go, oh yeah. Duh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you just and put it in, like, the red forest biome or whatever? Exactly. Yeah. And you light it up so that you don't get the uh, the other ones. And then that's Think about that. Unlimited crispy bacon. <laughs> um, mainly for the uh, the leather, though. Not the pork, so... Uh, so this way... Space. No! Oh, no! 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 See, that way you don't have to constantly twice. breathe and kill cows, because that's super annoying. You just kill mob hoglets. So. I mean, but you can just trade for leather now, right? Yeah, you yeah, can get that way though. faster to just uh, murder. Yeah, but it's well, not good. Well. I, I, I like the fact that you can you can get ah! leather without actually killing oh, things now. Oh, that was terrifying. What chat? Yeah. Uh, oh, did that one drop on you? That one dropped on me. Oh god, that, that one lived. Wow, Serge is or Joe's calling out your your farm, Serge. <laughs> I thought if anyone would have my back, <laughs> it'd be Joe. Oh, ah, but here you we sneaky, are. Sneaky, you sneaky. No. Oh, come on. Ow. Shoot. I don't know why I said ow. All right, there we go. Got well, it. there's a lot of piglins on this level now, so we should be careful about opening chests and whatnot. Look at this, though. I mean. We have we have torn down a lot. <laughs> I have um, almost three full shulkers of stuff now. Yeah, I think so do I. I think I've got two in my inventory. I haven't gotten a lot of gilded though, to be honest. I'm wondering if the I gilded's a I'm little at, bit lower. I think I'm at three. Yeah, I'm only well, at like again, two. It's, it's the rarest block I know in the it's, game now. It's, it's pretty rare, but like, you, I feel like we should have more than that. I picked and chose over like six different bastions. I got the thirty order or so. Like, yeah. Sure. Yeah, I maybe have like two or three. Uh, so that's gonna be the pure decadence, right? Where we uh, make the entire build out of. Oh, hey. Okay. So this is that's the open area. Yeah. Oh, wow. You, you just the way out. you just cannot see it from out here. Yeah. It was. That, it's very close to where we are, but it was only approachable from like one very, very, very like low key corner, right? God, Gilded really should be like a trade from Piglins. Uh, See, that, that would make sense. Uh, Virgil, 82 for 30 months. Welcome back. Thank you so much, friend. Appreciate it. All right. Not bad. Not bad. Okay. Um, so we are standing now at 64. Looks like you... Oh, oh God. that means we've done almost 30 layers, right? There is... Uh... Yeah, yeah, we were at 95. Oh, oh my God. 
This is quite the mob farm we've made for ourselves yeah. here. Well, at least they're fighting amongst themselves. Okay. Let's go over here. Oh boy, there they go. Well, we're off. Yeah, has anyone gotten anything interesting from the Bastion? I got a lodestone from a no, chest, I so I now have... anything good. Alright. Uh, there's, there's a crossbow in that chest up there, but it's got Curse of Vanishing on it, so... So Why nothing good. What? What's up, What's up, Joe? He's T-posing. t Right? I don't know, they were just like, like, bro T-posing at each other. Man. <laughs> Maybe you... Yep. The hog live? That was weird. You almost Tim Tebow as much as I do. Not at all. <laughs> not, not in any form. Are you kidding? Why? Tim Tebow of all people? Jesus. Uh... Are you trying to make me angry? Holy moly, James. I hate you so much right now. Is that uh, a... Is a football isn't it a, a football player? Uh, Became famous as a, in a meme uh, for a couple Wait, is, is that where T posing comes from? No, no, T posing is <laughs> different. Yeah, no, well, did, no, I know what T posing is. I just like, wait a second, T bow, T pose. T bow did, did a, a, a T bow kneel. Oh, Jesus. That was a big fall. I didn't much care for that fall. Uh, I just was reminded of Tim P. But when you started saying T posing, Uh, is he a baseball player now? Jeez, he used to be a quarterback. Wait, um, wait, 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 wait. Is he doing a Michael Jordan? Like, get famous in one sport and just, like, go peace out to another one? that famous. Like, he was, he was more... He was okay. Like, he was, a, he was good in college, and then his pro career was pretty lackluster. Yeah, oh, yeah. Definition of it. <laughs> yeah, like, he was... People were, like, expecting greatness, and he yeah. was the most pro college... Or I had to call it the quarterback in a while, so. Okay. What time is it? Oh, wow. 12.46. Yeah, he's also, yeah, not a great human. God, that never sounds weird now. I like the new noises. I thought before it's just... it didn't sound like anything, and now it actually has some character. Yeah, I agree with that. Yeah, it's just it goes boing every now and then. Oh, this I didn't know this whole section existed. Oh, yeah, you finally checked out. Yeah, yeah that was... Know, yeah, I've been working on kind of the main structure, and so I didn't realize this whole side structure existed. Yeah, we've been sort of tearing this bit down. For some reason, when you said... If you asked me I wanted to tear down the Bastion, I in my brain and I thought, Woodland Mansion? I'm like, why do we need a Woodland Mansion? Oh. For all the blocks, that's what, Joe. That's why I was really confused. <laughs> I was like, we need wood? What do we need that much wood for? Wooden like, carpet. Yeah, uh -huh. I was like, uh, I guess so, sure. Um, I actually went and found one of those in um, Punch a Chunk and burned it down. It was fun. <laughs> like, hey, I found it. Now what? Yeah, I now found, we watch I mean, it burn. We found it, right? we raided it, and then we burnt it to the ground. Those things are dumb. They are so bad. They, they, they need to be good. significantly yeah. better. 1.17. 1.17. The adventure update, right? I imagine hopefully they change strongholds. Hopefully they change all of those like map things. If the whole idea is to encourage people to explore more, you got to give them something Ow. to explore right. for, right? That was a shulker box. Pillager raids making being cooler probably. Uh, yeah, I, I'm hoping. I'm, I'm excited for 117 to be honest. Like obviously 116 only just came out, but um, the problem with um, the Minecraft development cycle. Is this it? Same shots. Um, sorry. Well, yeah, it's Snapshots just shots we get, but like, people already know everything yeah, about like, everything. We we've like, been uh, we've been in 116. I mean, technically only for like a month now, but we've we've known basically everything for like half a year yeah right like, yeah, yeah. friends after how's it, the how's it going? 15 came out actually they basically already knew it so then like, here's the 116 stuff um yeah so i mean it's the same thing that a lot of things like magic suffers from the same thing right it's like 
you oh, spend hey, I found you spend two weeks in spoiler season, and then the set comes out, and you play with it, and you're like, all right, next. I need to empty my inventory, but there's so many piglins around. Yeah, I would just fly away and then come back, like, honestly, or make yourself a little hole. I'm listening to, uh, like, a classic rock playlist, and the Mamas and the Papas just came on, and I'm very, very, very happy. Nice. Okay. Are you familiar with their hit single, Words of Love? Probably my favorite. The words of love, I love you. How are we doing over here? This goes way below 60. <laughs> I thought it stopped right about where lava is. Oh, I'm thinking the water. Like oh yeah, 60 you're right, you're right, you're right. Yeah, like, I was thinking the water level and yeah, yeah, yeah. No, you're right. What is what is the somebody probably knows this in the chat off the top. Something. Of the it's like third. It's five like or something. It's, yeah, it's it's quite a ways. So I conflated two facts. I was like, La uh, it stops at lava. Lava's where water is. Like no surge. Try that again. Ooh, who pissed, who pissed them off? Yeah, who did what? I'm in a hole! They shouldn't be able to see me. <laughs> they heard the chest. Yeah. They can smell it. Alright. Okay, good. I was like, oh god, please don't be another huge structure. Oh, somebody's mad. Run! Whoever did it! <laughs> they're not, they're not mad at me. Okay. Unless they're just ground. going on a hunt. I'm about to open one, so they'll probably be mad at me. Oh, or maybe not. I basically like dug myself a little cave. There's that whine noise again. Where, where did all of you go? I'd be a loud truck going around outside of my house, you know. Where'd you uh, go? No, it's, it's really not. It's like a boing in the never. All right, it's like a like a like an 80s ray gun. Where where'd you three go? I'm putting stuff away in a. In a yeah, place. every time I have to put something away, I just fly outside. All right, I'm back. I'm in that little expansion area that we were working in, James. Oh, okay, you're over there. Touchpick is dead, so I'm gonna put oh, it they're, uh, they're annoyed about something. Gear equips. I don't mean they're mad at me. Okay. Oh, they're mad at me. I hit the gold block. Oh, well, I don't care. Maybe I should care? No, you shouldn't. You should just kill him. Oh, this is bad. I got stuck in a hole and had to fly away. Very scary. Stop I mean, looking at me. I like the uh, little shame chests that some people have started leaving just on. Oh, yeah. Uh, dang it, I'm a ding dong. You alright, buddy? What happened? Broke my ender chest with a fortune pick. Oh no! <laughs> uh, I did it without thinking. Are these? Yep, they're all chasing me. Um, I'm opening this chest. What's up? Come after me. 
Come at me, bro. Yeah. <laughs> I'm trying to get rid of all the little floating islands we have so that when we do try and fly away, we don't hit something and die. I'm actually going to, because I'm kind of curious, I'm going to go into spectator mode here and see how we've... Jeez, this Stop. thing is huge. How much more do we got? Come tear oh, down the basket, he said. Oh my it God. Could be fun, he said. Yeah. It's actually... Uh, I mean... <laughs> James, that goes so deep. <laughs> uh, it goes down to thirty-one. We do not Are we have, have halfway? So halfway. we we've gotten the majority of like the big chunk done, and now it starts to get kind of like windy. It gets into those like windy ah, paths. Um, so I would say we're definitely we've done more than half, but so we've broken the back of it. And is there anything so we have five over... minutes left of the show. Do you think we can push this... and get this done? Yeah, absolutely. Five minutes. Oh, oh yeah, five thing. minutes. We can get this all yeah. done in five. Easy peasy. Easy peasy. I mean, we probably... I mean, we definitely have enough resources to get started, so... Uh... No. Go ancient debris farming for actual blackstone, and then polish it and make all the stuff, right? Like yeah, like I, I think let's get let's um actually let's um basically Should finish like this level or something. Else. Yeah, I'm just gonna quickly peek at that. Yeah, see, this is what I want. I want to get all of this gilded blackstone because there's a bunch that are like yeah. Oh, they're mad. They're mad at someone. Probably me because I'm stealing their gilded blackstone. Oh god, yeah, see this would just take forever to do. God, this whole, uh, right? like, like oh my gosh. And we've gotten it took us like an hour to do thirty layers. So it'll probably be another hour, maybe an hour and a half to do the other thirty, so Oh, this actually is a nice proper dead end. Yes, there we go. I'm just gathering up all the Ooh! Ooh! They're mad nice at someone. Fun. Yeah, probably, James probably me. Around. I'm I'm stealing all their gold. Ah, you found the secret gold stash behind the pig faces. Yeah. Uh, clearly, if you don't finish the city, chat wins by default. That seems fair. Uh, Trahas, twelve months. Is this a sub baby? Uh, no. Check Is this the magical sub baby I've heard so much about? How do I get? Oh, dude. It's pronounced super puppy. Oh, dude, dude. I, I go back to that dead end. There's another gilded one you were just in. Uh, I have three gilded from today. I so. don't know. There's the two by two at the end of where you're in. And at the in the ceiling at the very end where it touched oh, uh, yeah, yeah, the yeah. rack. Thank you. All right. I've got six more here. I mean, we do at some point we do need to collate all this as yeah well. that's what i was gonna say let's um right now actually let's head back to um the nether hub and yeah. uh take stock of what we have uh, i'm just gonna quickly make sure that i have all of the easy to find aha there's another piece and another piece Uh -huh. Yeah, it seems to like there's a bunch when you get down into the um into these little tunnels. Um all right, so now I need to figure out how to get the heck out of here. Actually, if you go to that little um corner, well, not corner, that little area that we had been mining in James. Uh if you fly straight out of there, you'll find the tunnel. I think I I found a way out. <laughs> here uh keep that one joe so wait how did you get out of here so find that little that little red forest tunnel at the Aha. other end remember that weird little expansion we're working on oh whatever you'll find it you'll figure it out yeah i figured it out uh which direction is it 
Uh, my clock surge and portal this way. All right, let's uh, let's take stock. Uh, hub and gold farm. Here we go. Joe's been working so hard for us right now. Nice. Okay. Hello, friends. All right. Ender pearls in it. Yes. Got. Uh, I think this is your ender pearl box search. Oh, did I put down the wrong red box? Yeah. Or just no, the wrong plain box? Sorry. Yeah. Red is an odd word for me to say. Yeah, that, that is my box of ender pearls. You mean we don't want to build the structure out of just ender pearls? Oh, shoot. I just realized that by doing that. There we go. Okay. Some of these can't be opened. Okay. Can you grab that one for me, Joe? I mean, I separated it, so. uh, I'm actually kind of curious about. So there's some gilded. Gilded. This one can't be opened. These are all polished. No, cracked. Oh, got some more gilded cracked. there. I spent approximately zero time actually organizing the Oh, boxes. yeah, mine, mine is I, not. I did a little bit just because I had to take one full of different things, and then toward the end, I was like, screw it. Put it all along, so. Who knows? So they're over here. I have 16 gilded. Nice. From that. And we have a tremendous. I have, I have a gilded on me as well. I'm in the middle of organizing things. Sweet. I get, don't don't worry about it. Just put bring the uh, boxes and put them over here, and then um, I'll. I'll find some time to actually organize everything. So we are good to go for next week when we actually start figuring out what this room is going to look like. Uh, but that's going to do it. We're done. That's a good stream. Fixed the farm. Uh, made some more uh, red nether brick and tore down, I don't know, 40% of a bastion. I'm happy with our progress. Uh, Heck yeah. Joe, Uno, Serge, thanks for hanging out. I will talk to you three later. It's been a pleasure. Bye, friends. Bye. Um, and yeah, thanks everybody for hanging out today. Thanks for all the subs and the resubs, um, the bits, the follows. If you're not following the channel, hit that follow button. I'd appreciate it. If you do, the little heart in the top right corner will shine red. It'll let you know that, that you followed us. Um, Coming up next is Talking Sim with Corey and Cameron. And then uh, we've got Let's Nope later tonight uh, from uh, 5 till 8 p.m. And then all sorts of stuff. I think we actually have a we have a thing here, right? Bam! Bloodborne tomorrow. Crossing the Streams Pummel Party. More Pummel Party. We're going to do it with eight people. Should be a lot of fun. Thursday, Play It Forward. Uh, Lure MTG and Tinker Taylor. Um, and then Chill Point on Friday with paper, uh, Friday Night Paper Fight. We're going to play some Jumpstart on Arena. Um, it's not on the schedule yet, but I am planning on doing a uh, one more on Saturday, starting at around 1. So that'll just be a, a chill uh, Valorant stream uh, with me and whoever is free and available to hang out. Um, and yeah, that's about it. Thanks for hanging out, friends. Hope you have a good day. Um, stay tuned. As I said, half an hour. And uh, we got ourselves uh, some talking sim. So stick around for that. We're going to run some commercials on the way out. Pre pre release on YouTube when? Now. It's already there. I think. I'm going to look like a. I'm going to look stupid if it's not, but I'm pretty sure. YouTube.com slash alert and PG. Yep, it's there. It's been there for four hours, in fact. Four hours! All right. Bye, friends.